Uh-oh, I wouldn't go in there if I were you. Didn't you read the signs? And look at all that trash. A messy room is just the start. By next year, she'll be jaywalking. Then again, it's a shame to throw out such nice stuff. Come to think of it, there's a lot of nice things in here. Ooh, a hammer. Maybe we could put it to better use. And pallets, a builder's best friend. After glue guns and duct tape. With some cardboard and a little hammer and nails. These pallets can become your very own castle. But maybe we should add that little something extra. <gasps> maybe something in these garbage bags. Or better yet, the bags themselves. They make for some nice curtains in a pinch. And we can roll them up whenever we don't need them. Ooh, nail polish. I wasn't gonna say anything, but <laughs> oh, those nails. Oh, you're using it to decorate. <laughs> Forget I said anything. Not bad. Is there anything else we can use? Cool, spray paint, because we should probably save that nail polish. That's a nice way to get some texture. Black and yellow. She must really like bees. Or Hufflepuff. And nothing beats a good stencil when it comes to painting. When she's done, she should use this for an art studio. Ooh, chains. What else can we add? <gasps> to think that someone wanted to get rid of all this nice paper. But now we can use it all to wallpaper this house. Do we have enough? Where else can we get paper? Oh, good idea. Those poems aren't doing you any good in your diary. And these old magazine clippings, too. But do you know what would really lighten things up? A window. She's got a good reach. And this wrapping paper will help fill up this window. Much easier to install than glass. She seems to like stars. But I don't think she wants to sleep under them. We need a roof. Hmm. This clothesline should help. Nice of her to leave the clothes. Time to put your knot tying skills to work. Girl Scouts, don't fail me now. Let's just hope it doesn't rain anytime soon. See? I told you she liked looking at stars. Yes! Ugh. Hmm, this floor seems pretty uncomfortable. No one will miss this duvet cover and pillows. They left it outside. And with a little imagination and stuffing, they can become a mattress. Aw, isn't this teddy bear cute? And more importantly, filled with stuffing. You know, we probably could have stuffed in the whole bear. Let's put all this trash to work. Especially when there's so much fun to be had with the bag. Blow it up. And we've got a bunch of pillows. Now what's she up to? Oh, 
Oh, this car tire can make a really good swing. Or some nice shelves. <laughs> really thinking outside the box. For the box. And look at that. It rolls right to the box. Time for some decorating. Bring out the spikes. Now she can listen to music as loud as she wants. Charges of noise pollution notwithstanding. But if we're careful, we could put this broken glass to better use. Soften the sides with hot glue, and it's a nice mirror. Don't you just love when you find free stuff in trees? Though, if the feathers make you sneeze, should you really use it? Oh, haven't seen her in a while. Hmm. What's she up to? Oh, what a shame. Wasting all that good yarn hmm. like that. We can use it for another craft. With a few twists and turns, we can decorate this letter E without sewing. And at this rate, we can decorate the whole alphabet. How nice, teaching that little boy to share. Rainbows are nice, but it's missing a special color, black. Now it's part of a foot massage walkway. Oh, and right to the pool, too. I wonder what she's planned for this hula hoop next. It needs to be filled up, except for the center. Now she can have snacks while taking a dip. Wow! Looks like somebody's a little envious. Oh, they patch things up, meaning she gets to keep her pool privileges. Huh? Ah, yes, the table. <laughs> Mankind's last hope against monsters. Oh. But at least now you've got your own fort. Now it's starting to look like a little stage. Oh. And how cute. You've got a little window. Hmm. Ah, did I say window? Make that flower. Make that flowers. Wow. Oh. Good idea. Netting will help keep out the monsters. What are you doing with that ribbon? Oh, wow. It's like a curtain for the curtains. Hmm, hiding's kind of boring. What else can we do? These pool noodles might help. Go ahead, split them in half. Lie them down, and you've got something soft to lie on. A mop? Let's plant them up on top and give this fort a roof. Good idea. Some strong tape will help keep them in place. Still, this roof seems pretty bare. Let's cover it up.
cut an opening, and it can be a makeshift tent, too. So make sure to do this with a blanket that you can afford to lose. Hmm? I wonder what we can do with these jeans next. Well, for starters, we're cutting it up. And making measurements. Hmm. Oh. And don't forget to add those little touches, like some yarn and hot glue. Cut up the yarn down the middle. Look at it open up. Keep on adding the yarn, and soon you'll have a cute little rug. This fort just keeps looking better and better. What more can we do? With these stickers, we can enjoy the night sky without the whole outdoors thing. Ooh. Turn off the lights and they also work as night lights that won't hurt your electric bill. What's next? Please be a TV. Oh, a basketball. A deflated basketball. Anybody <laughs> out there who didn't think she'd bring out those scissors? Oh, so that's what the inside wow. looks like. But what can we do with it? <sighs> now that's a creative way to dress up a house plant. And with a plant in here, we'll just be drowning in oxygen. Ooh. Perfect. Let's add some toys. That's always a great idea. Oh. Yeah. Good thing all those poppet toys broke her fall. And now she's cutting up the buttons because, of course, she is. Oh, please don't tell me she's looking for more stuff to cut up. Actually, that's pretty clever. Now it's like a little lamp. And you can hang a bunch of them in all this open air. Oh. But what's a sky full of stars without the whole yeah. world? Just clean it up and spruce up that handle. A globe has to look its best. Paint job? Now how will we learn about countries? Eh, I guess there's always the internet. Hmm. Hmm, purple, black, and white. It looks like the cosmos now. And there's nothing that can't be improved by adding glitter. On the plus side, we have a place to stash all of this candy. With all this stuff, will there still be room for the rest of us? Ooh, we have some extra ribbons. Let's decorate the outside. Bonus, bonus episode! Time for a fun day at the park. And all our friends are here. But it doesn't look like they're going to take turns. Or anyone else here for that matter. Oh, don't cry. Maybe we can make our own fun. Or hmm. just go home and watch TV. Or take a tire from an abandoned car. Any guesses what she's up to? For starters, she's cutting it up. 
And this ain't a job for scissors. And a nice paint job will help perk things up. And good thing she has a bunch of wood to help with this project. Secure two blocks to a long plank and add the tire on top. It looks like a teeter-totter, but we still need some handles. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and this poppet toy will make a nice seat. Unfortunately, the problem with teeter-totters is that they require more than one person. Hey. Aw, turns out she hey. had a friend all along. Wow! Can we make a roller coaster next? Oh, there's nothing sadder than a cat person without a cat. Luckily, it looks like that's about to change. Oh, it's a kitty. And she's so fluffy. Something tells me that's not rain. Whatever it is, it's coming with a chance of kittens. Ooh, are you having a tom or a queen? Two of each? Mommies in the making need lots of love and attention. Especially when they start shedding. Don't worry, our cat brush will fix you right up. This'll catch all that excess hair. Ew. And disposal couldn't be easier. Who wants a paw rub? Let's tuck you in and count some white mice. Huh, this curtain just sparks inspiration. From table to fort, a cat fort. Complete with a big fluffy teddy bear. Bring those two bear paws together. And keep them that way. Add a cushion. It's your own little chair, in your own little corner. Wow, construction's thirsty work, you know. No, but save some water. It's just what our toilet water dish needs. So fresh and clean, you'll want a sip for yourself. Don't forget some TP, always comes in handy. After all, accidents do happen. Some kibble will pair great with all this water. Oh, there's a prize. Oh, we found Nemo. Of course, every fish needs a bowl. Why not add a little island in the middle? Just add water, too. Now it's all ready for our robot fish. Round and round they go. Ooh, careful! Oh, I think you broke that brush. No matter, those bristles look all right. Just add some glue, and it's a new scratching post. Wow, you sure go through a lot of brushes. <laughs> Ugh, we need to get a litter box in here. In the meantime, Ew. it's time for a little 52 pickup. Ew. Looks like she's got an idea. And just in time, too. Start by cutting a little door on the side. <laughs> Maybe something in this old Christmas box will help. No, not this. Not that. Aha! Our tiny Christmas tree. I knew it wasn't such a bad little tree after all. 
In fact, we'll need a few to cover up the sides. <laughs> Just lay out the green carpet and a plastic bag. Don't forget to glue it all together. Add some sand, like every litter box needs. Uh, gravity is just not your friend today. But cardboard is far more agreeable. You can make it into all sorts of new things. All it needs is some old Christmas lights. And why not add a pillow at the bottom? I think your bird shedding must be catching. Eh, loose feathers means crafting supplies. Add this to a string and add some beads. Let's hang these up like a beaded curtain. And it's the perfect place for all your old gum. We should add a pillow on top. Look, there's even a door! <laughs> we'll need stairs, unless cats can fly. Ooh, nice pom-pom. Can we borrow it? A few of these will brighten up the doorway. Oh, I think Kitty wants to help. Uh, maybe not. Either way, this broom is just what we needed. Take an empty box and fill it up with a bunch of bristles. Pour a little cement on the bottom. Not too much. We want those bristles sticking out so Kitty can play with them. Uh-oh. Hope we didn't use up all our brooms. Hey, there's something in the plant pot. Oh, it helps you make paw prints. And we've got plenty of paws. <laughs> this is going right in our collage. Ooh, beach balls on tap. Now that's fancy. But let's not forget about all that string either. Wrap it around and glue it into place. Now all we need is something to stand it on. And something sharp. Don't worry, I said we've got them on tap. Cut an opening. It'll help get the ball out. And your kitty cat in. Wow, someone tell that ostrich we found her egg. It looks like it's ready to hatch. Let's help. Ooh, confetti. And a cute baby duck. Sure had a lot of room in there. Mm -hmm. Looks like someone's got a new best friend. Meanwhile, let's have fun with all this laundry. These green tights are just what we needed. Start by folding one into the other. and tie them to these chair legs. You've got a little hammock right in your room. <laughs> hey. So who wants to try it out? Any takers? What happened to our feline friend? Well, at least we've got a sock. So many holes. Let's make some more. Take these tubes and add frills toward the end. <laughs> Accessorize and your kitty friend's got a brand new outfit. Put your paw through and you're photo ready. Perfect time for a snack break. But first, let's have some fun with the container. We really just need the bottom. It works even better than tracing paper. 
Draw the outline and then color it in. When you're finished, cut it out. Leave some room to punch a hole in at the top. Now we just need to add some heat. This will shrink things down to size. It's the right size for our new necklace. All dressed up for a nice night at home. <laughs> Your brand new cat home. Let's explore. Wow, those cats know how to live. Guess somebody's got some cat scratch fever. Now that's a bear hug. Time to descend the stairs like you just had a makeover. And there's so many places to catnap. But I think this is her favorite spot. <laughs> Remember to order that big liter of milk and a 20 pound salmon. Good, now does the cat want anything? Pretty cool stuff. Catch you next time. Okay, almost done. Congratulations. This girl's going to be a cat person. Unfortunately, pets aren't allowed here. But when it comes to cats and cat ladies, love always finds a way. I won't tell dad if you won't. Wait till you see the best part. This cat already comes with kittens. Now let's clean you up with our very own cat tongue. Soon you'll do this for the kittens. Actually, I think both of them will. Ooh, someone needs a bath. Now let's put on your shower cap. Oh, right, cats don't like water. That's why we've got a special cleaning kit. Add a little foam and comb it into the fur. Now your cat smells brand new. It's time for a little redecorating. Careful, you don't want to lose such precious dirt. Let's sweep it all into a corner. Make sure to spread it out. Grab a rubber chicken or other garden tools. We're gonna plant some seeds. Don't forget to water, and pretty soon, you'll have your very own grass carpet. <laughs> now grab some cardboard and add them to the sides. Now, we'll need a bowl. An empty one. Use it to draw a circle. And cut it out. And the bowl should fit right in. Let's make a bunch of these little windows. Hey, do we need to clean the cat again? No, it's coming from this old pizza box. Ditch the pizza, but let's keep the box. In fact, a bunch of these boxes will help us make a kitty bathroom. Complete with all the amenities. Think outside the litter box. Hey, I think she likes it. 
But first, it's petting time. Who's a good girl? If only we had some room to move. Here's an idea. Let's distract the cat. Grab a bunch of different pillows. And make yourself a decoy you. See, kitty? An even softer lap. And we're free to go explore. Just in time. I think I just heard something inside your closet. Ooh, the dolls are having a party. Complete with a little mini fridge. Now we can fill it up with all of our cat's favorite feasts. Well, when dad's away, the cat will play. Okay, a typing cat is impressive. But dad's not supposed to see you. So let's get you out of here. Still, if you like computers so much, we'll make one just for you. One that's also a scratching post. And it's so fun to sit on. Oh, hey, what you looking at? Ooh, birds. I wish we had our own bird. And now we do! A rainbow parrot! It can fly, too. Eh, everyone's a critic. Well, at least we still like it. But you know what else is fun? A great big cardboard box! Thanks. Let's tear it apart and put it back together, but in a whole new way. Otherwise, it'd just be busy work. <laughs> Don't forget to close up the back. It looks like a television set. Let's put on the mouse network. Talk about interactive television. But in life, cats are the stars, and we are just the spectators. Uh-oh! Dad needs new glasses. But let's hope he keeps them for now. Oh, and by the way, happy birthday! He's got a special surprise for you. It's a new cat! Well, a toy one. Because you don't have a real one. And to keep him thinking that, let's put this fur remover to good use. And he's none the wiser. Wait, where's the cat? Uh-oh, she's on the prowl! And she's on a feng shui kick. Hmm, let's get something that'll keep her distracted. Like this fun whack-a-mouse gadget. And the best part, no tokens required. <laughs> Let's hope she washed her paws first. Quick, grab it! Or at least turn it over. As for Dad, who wants pizza? And how about we fill up all these paw prints?
Give it time to dry and flip it over. And it fits right on your cat's collar. Gimme paw. It's the gift that keeps on giving. Mm -hmm. Next up, we're gonna need a sock. Now add to a glass container and fill with dirt. Add some seeds, cover with more dirt, and tie up that sock like peas in a pod. Let's add some cute little antennae. Spray on water. Watch the plants grow. And give your cat a new treat. It wiggles, too. Wow, this place is really coming together. It's where all the cool cats want to be. And what Dad doesn't know won't hurt him. Of course, even with all the fun stuff we've made, Sometimes, all you need is a place for a little cat nap. Huh, this cat doesn't look like he belongs to anyone. So let's fix that. Make your shirt into a pouch. And bring him to your house, which shall henceforth be his house. Cats usually clean themselves, but this looks like a big job. At least, skin's easier to clean than fur. This looks like a job for one of our gadgets! A cat brush. And when you're done, look how easy it is to remove the hair. Which also makes it easy to use in crafts. After all, cat hair's better as earmuffs than on your couch. While we're at it, let's do something about those nails. But why stop at just cleaning those nails? These clips fit right on. And think of all the money we'll save on polish. <laughs> wow, lipstick for paws. I would have just called it paw stick. <laughs> Good idea, a massager. You know, it's hard work being a cat. Yeah, he should feel nice and relaxed. Now how can we make this dinner table more cat-friendly? Maybe this cardboard box can help. After all, cats already prefer the box to whatever's inside. And you can do no wrong with some colored tape. Look at all these colors. It's like a rainbow of tape. Hmm. Ew. With this plastic bowl, we can make a window. If only it was this easy making a window into a bowl. Aww. What else can we add? Honestly, I'm not surprised lawns are free. With all that hassle of mowing them, some people might even pay you to take it. Ah. Oh, some free clothes just lying around could be useful. Ah yes, jeans. Like your skirt, but with legs. Let's stuff it up with some of these other clothes. And tie the legs up together like a pretzel. Our project is almost done. Just add the roof. And a few finishing touches, like these sticky notes. Place them down in a pattern like roof shingles. Hmm, what else is nice and sticky? Great idea, a sticker. 
we can personalize our furry friend's new home away from home. Is there anything else a cat would like? <gasps> These brushes will make fun self-groomers. What else do cats like? Clothespins? Do cats like clothespins? Okay, I see where she's going with this. A fish mobile. Furnishing a house has never been so delicious. Oh, and what a lovely picture frame. Excuse us, we're just gonna borrow this too. Wow, this mat fits inside the frame. What are the odds? And now we have a brand new scratching post. This flower pot has a lot of space. Cut it open, and it's a perfect private makeshift litter box. Oh, water. Cats need Aww. water too, right? Let's add a cat water fountain. Just add water. It looks like our fish mobile is yes. getting nice and pungent. Do you have anything else we could add? These beads could add just the right touch. Let's just run some thread through them. This would make a great friendship bracelet. Wow! But now, tie up the excess string and cut. This way, it ends in a little pom-pom. Make different sizes for your new beaded <laughs> curtains. Next, let's cut up a hole in this stool. Add a plate right on top. And with the help of these silicone molds, we can fill it up with the best custom-made snacks. And just think of all these different flavors. Hmm. She's got that look in her eyes. She's got ideas Ooh. for this traffic cone. We'll need to cut up this plastic bottle and add hot glue. Add some around the rim to soften things up. Add to the cone. And fill it up with even more cat treats. <laughs> of course, what's a cat house without a ball of yarn? Except we're gonna use it for our next craft. I wonder if this girl's ever played Cat's Cradle. I feel like it'd be right up her alley. Oh, these plush toys would be great for that net we just made. Of course, you can't have much of a cat house without a cat. Let's see how he likes it. Does he love it or does he love it? A free hat? Well, these wonders never cease. He's having a lot of fun looking at stuff. And would you look at that, he's potty trained with an actual pot. Now to kick back with a nice snack. And some more snacks. The only thing better than having a cat is being a cat. Meow, amazing stuff. Catch you next time. Aw, what a cute little family. Yay! But things change. Time to meet your new stepdad! <laughs> Looks like supper's ready. Time to stop whatever you're doing. My, what big feet you have! Aw, don't cry. Look who's here. Maybe we can fix up some of her toys. 
Huh? Uh huh. That'll cheer her up. Grab a wooden pallet. Add pieces of cardboard around it. Of course, these walls could use windows. You know, some curtains should help too. Come on. Wow. Add some tinsel curtain too. I mean, it is shiny. Ooh. Next up, grab some toilet paper. Eh, I'm sure he won't miss it. What? Yeah! It's not much, but all we really need <laughs> is the roll. Now we're gonna need some glitter. And a lot of hot wow. air. You'll see. Now these walls are gonna sparkle. Hey, something smells good. Oh, well, I guess stepdad isn't too bad. After all, he's got great taste in cookie cutters. And we can use them to help decorate. Gotcha! What? Don't worry, they were delicious. Put down the cutter and add some paint. Now we can add all sorts of shapes. Uh-oh, it looks like rain. We're gonna need a roof stat. Hey, how much tinfoil do you have? Let's just use that. One roof coming up. And the best part, it's yes. so easy to make holes in it. Comes in handy when you want lights. It's like our own little planetarium. <sighs> Looks like everyone's hearing about this place. I'd be careful with that <laughs> net if I were you. Something tells me that's one crafty Ooh. butterfly. And speaking mm. of crafts and butterflies, let's make our own and hang them up. <laughs> and these guys won't fly away. Wow. What's next? Oh, the laundry's huh? done. <laughs> yes. Why don't we collect them all in a laundry bag? It'll make a great pillow for our fort. Oh, it's a unicorn! And by the looks of it, it's not gonna be the only one. Careful with that. Let's collect all these pellets in a bag. They're what puts the squish in squishy. Now add to a plate and cover it up. Soon, we'll have a whole rainbow's worth of squishy fun. Yeah. Well, what are yeah. you waiting for? It's not gonna unclog itself. What? <laughs> Actually, it might. But plungers yes, are just yeah. so much fun. Huh? In fact, Let's make it a new addition to our fort. Uh, probably clean it off first. In fact, let's use four plungers and make a table. Use tape for the tabletop, but let's add some cutouts too. Why don't we add some lights too? Now we need another layer of tape. Let's find the perfect place for it. Whoa. Now, let's head out for our next craft. Hmm. Hmm. Hey, who's that Pokemon? Well, whoever he is, he'll Ugh. make a great stencil. <laughs> let's try it out. Draw out the shape. And then cut out the material, too. Huh? Hey, anyone?
anyone feel a draft? Nah. Hmm, he's starting to look familiar. It's Pikachu! And more importantly, our new vanity. Ah, looking good. <laughs> what else can we add? Fake huh? grass. We'll use it to decorate the fort. It's the perfect camouflage out here. Adding some leaves should help too. Yay! Now let's use these old slippers. Nail it to the wall, and now it's got pockets. After all, everything's better with pockets. Hey, there's practically one for each toy. He sure does sleep a lot, doesn't he? Gotcha. He must have had a turkey dinner. Anyway, we'll need a pool noodle wow. and a ball. Slice it in half and add to the end. Now add some feathers all around it. It looks like a fancy palm tree. <sighs> hey, watch where you're throwing. Well, maybe we can use this bottle. Cut it up and blow up a balloon inside. <sighs> Add some wings and a face. <laughs> and it's a cute little bumblebee. Oh no! What, what is it? Moles? Wow. Worms? Oh wait, it's a friendly little pop tube. Wow. Ooh, it's a big one. Make it a circle. Now we're gonna need some hangers. Stretch them out. They'll help us hang up the circle. It's a basketball hoop. All you need's a ball. Foam letters? Oh. Take a pool noodle and make an arch. Let's make a whole bunch of them for the doorway. Now it's time for the big unveiling. Oh my God. Come on, Yay. crawl inside. Wow. Ooh, and you're just the right size. Pikachu. It's a tiny place all your own. Ah, <laughs> oh, this could be a racetrack for toy cars. Or you Yay. could just do that, I guess. Hey. You can look outside. <laughs> Or you can stay in and relax. There's so much to see. And there's plenty of things to do. Time for a quick mirror check. Up for a game of hoops? It looks like he wants to play. Sorry, fella. Amusement park rules. You gotta be this small to ride. But don't worry. You can join the fun. Oops. Who's up for a little face painting? Uh, maybe we should get you out of there. Oops. Now just shake hands and make up. Oh, what a happy family photo. But families grow and change all the time. You know, you could have just used Photoshop or something. <laughs> My, what big feet you have. You could at least apologize. Just a heads up. This is how that talky Tina thing started. Look, today's dad's day. 
Is it the 28th of the month already? Aw, oh, don't cry. Dad will make you something even better. We're gonna need to get creative. Let's move the desk. First, we'll need one plastic barrel. Preferably without monkeys. Oh, even better. It comes with power tools. Make some cuts into the barrel. Try doing that with a monkey. Nail down the sides to a plank of wood. Now just add pool noodles to the side. Nail it right into place. Keep it secure. And it's a slide. And the perfect <laughs> size for Dolly. Excuse us, we're just gonna need this ladder. Like you can't afford a new one, Mr. Dollar Sign Necklace. Now staple some fluff to the ladder's sides. Wow, like a ladder to heaven! Let's add a board to the side. Don't hit your thumb. According to cartoons, that happens a lot. Oh, look, a package! I wonder what's inside. Eh, the best part's usually the box. I stand corrected. Wow! I mean, you just can't beat bubble wrap. Needs a splash of color. Can't beat rainbow. Add to the wall, and it's an instant paint job. How about we punch out a few <laughs> holes next? Yeah. Add some hot glue around the rim. Ooh. Make some flat paper cones to put on top. Because bigger is better when it comes to bubbles. Just remember to pop them back, too. Ooh. Now we'll need some glue and glitter. Wow, he's so rich, he sheds glitter. This'll add some much-needed sparkle to our last wall. Ooh, this should shed some light on things. An LED net. You know, we're gonna need something to add on top. For a softer touch, let's add some pillows. Kiss those throw pillows goodbye. We just need that stuffing for now. This might be a two, maybe three pillow job. Much better. Talk about sleeping under the stars. A slinky. When it rains, it pours, but in a good way. Add some hot glue along the top, just the top, and fill up any empty spaces up on top. You'll never lose a slinky again. <laughs> hey, don't do that. We could have returned it for store credit. Huh, maybe all this stuff can fix these old pillows. Don't worry, Teddy, we haven't forgotten you. We've got a whole brand new torso for you. Wow, look at these cool pillows. Mm -hmm. A Lego block? Make four blocks on wheels. And a giant square to lay on top. Maybe add a frame and attach the four legs. It's a mobile table. Uh, I mean, footrest. Oh, look. Someone must have lost their wallet. Let's keep an eye on it for uh, safekeeping. What pretty green paper. It'll be great for crafts. Ben here's all heart. Ooh, this one's laminated. And these cards all have got fancy chips. And not the salt and vinegar kind. Now I'm hungry. What sweet little hearts. Chain them together. And hang them up like a beaded curtain. 
You can even hang them to the side if you want. Now we'll need some slippers. Nice socks. Hang them on the wall for some makeshift cubbies. Keep whatever you want inside. Probably should clean them first. Going on a trip? Still, he probably won't miss this bag. Let's open it up. Ooh, a sock. I told you to clean those slippers. Now let's fill the inside with some foil. Look, it's like a DIY refrigerator. No outlet required. Candy and soda sold separately. Still, I think we've earned ourselves a snack. Mmm, what else do we need? Aha, a box. Cut a hole in the opening. And let's add a coat of paint, too. Now it's time to lay it down. So we can poke some holes in the back. Just big enough to fit these lights. Don't make them too big. Wow, that's bright! Back up a bit! Oh, Ooh. you've got the whole world in your hands. Still, it could use some gold fringe. Who needs the whole earth when you've got a disco ball? <laughs> yeah! Silver and gold just go together. Don't question it. Once again, hang these curtains to the side. I thought it looked like a doll box. Now we'll need an office chair and some cardboard. <laughs> It looks like we're making a rocket ship. A nice starry look seems on brand. Let's just keep it in the corner, shall we? And get you-know-who ready for the big unveiling. Okay, you can open your eyes now. It's a whole playground right in the room. There's a little room perfect for some Whoa! me time. Oh, wow. And there are so many things to do. There's places for all her belongings. <laughs> oh! Look, the fridge is full. And even better, comped. Uh, sort of. Well, she's not paying for anything. And the piece de la resistance, a giant box, where the daughter can be her own dolly. If the doll box fits, it's time for a photo shoot. There's even a slide for all her stuffed animals. Now it's time to try out that rocket. Oh, our wicked stepfather has returned. Ew, moles are such nasty little things. Let's do some pest control, shall we? Wow, I think she broke a record. Ouch! Ouch! Ah, wonder if she knows Oscar the Grouch. Now, who would get rid of such a nice bunk bed? Although, I guess they kept the mattress. But just look! Free lumber! Probably should clear these cobwebs. Think this boot's any good? Ah, it's like our own little slice of heaven. The sides need a little something. Let's add some insulation tape. Just add everything in a nice crisscross pattern. Any colors you want. Don't forget that there's more than one side. 
I guess we can leave the front one alone. But let's do something special for the back. Just staple a sheet or old curtain onto the wall. Probably should do something about the top, too. Excuse us, we just need to borrow this. Thank you. Toilet paper is so versatile. Just fold it up. Add some cuts to give it some fringe. And attach a bunch to the top in layers. Just imagine running your fingers through all this. Ooh, must have gotten the ultra soft kind. Look, a box of stuff we can use. Pop it toys. And they're the perfect shape for our new floor. Think of all the bubbles you can pop just by lying down. And then some. You know what they say, one man's trash is another's treasure. Uh, make that pillow stuffing. Trash makes for an excellent pillowing stuffing. Out of many pillows can come, well, a really big pillow. It's like staples can fix up anything. Wow, a free tire just rolled along to us. Let's give it a fresh coat of paint. And add some planks of wood inside. It can be a shelf for books, or whatever you need shelves for. This guy isn't going to do an ollie anytime soon. Still, that's one way to get a free skateboard. Besides, all it needs is a little love. And duct tape, especially the duct tape. Some glitter can't hurt either. Pour it on. With all this glitter, this board's going to be pink. Told ya. Hang it up, and it's the perfect place for our pigeon. Okay, the bin's been doing that thing again. Oh, it's a neon LED strip. No wonder it's so bright. Let's add some color with this tape. And hang it up in our secret room. Ooh, a heart. Do you think this trail leads somewhere? Whoa, even more blocks. Just imagine all the different things we can build with them. Like this cute little chair. And it's just right for Huggy Wuggy. <laughs> Looks like someone's getting a room warming present. Just can't beat shiny gift wrap. Let's wrap it around this circular base. Now we just need something to stand it on. And maybe some decorations around the border. It's a brand new reflective table. This sock has seen better days. Let's add it to the wall. Pouches aren't just for marsupials. Why stop at just one? Ah, what a busy day of building stuff. Well, there's no use crying over spilled paint. Let's hope Mr. Bear here is super absorbent. Don't worry, this nice big pillow should help dry you off. Now we've got our own teddy bear pillow. <laughs> hey, watch the cow! Oh great, it's broken. Better hide the evidence. Okay, you really need to stop stepping on animals. Oh, I see, you're using them for your next craft. Just needs a little something. Aha, some wood. It can hold all these animal pieces, so they can help hold everything else up. 
They're our new hangers. Oh, I don't think anyone's using that potted plant. Although, we really only need the pot for now. Just like how we really only need this dustpan. Let's pour some paint, or should I say paints, inside. Pour over the pot turned upside down and watch the colors blend. Don't let everything blend too much, or it will all be one mucky color. Once it dries, we can turn it right side up. What else can we do? Maybe these pool noodles can help. All you need to do is break it apart. Now we'll need to slice a wedge out from the side. Cut out a few more to give it some ridges. It's a toy cactus. It'll need some bristles. Good thing she's got plenty of hair to spare. Besides, hair has that crazy habit of growing back. Add a bunch and a pattern, and our cactus is looking good. And it's the perfect fit for our little multicolored pot. Look, there's plenty of room on the pigeon swing. Wow, an old boot. And there's plenty of things inside. Do you think this paper cup is still good? For starters, let's see if it can still hold straws. Let's mix things up. Add a balloon on top. Oh, and happy birthday! Our little hot air balloon could use some decorations too. Don't forget, we'll also need some passengers. Since it's pretty grounded, it can be a neat centerpiece. We deserve a snack. Maybe something to wash it down with. Better yet, we can make something with this straw. Cut it in half and join it back together at an angle. Make a bunch for some geometric shapes. Hexagons! Hang it up on the wall. And it's the perfect place for all your favorite photos. As I always say, there's always room for balloons. Besides, this way, your place is always ready for a party. In other words, it's always a good time for company. Besides, you gotta show off all this stuff. And most of these things are real conversation starters. After all that work, the best part is just getting to relax afterwards. Huggy Wuggy could sure get comfortable here. And this is the perfect spot for a little romantic moment. Watch out for that lid! Careful, that pigeon's a rental. Now to make a lovely duvet cover from these underpants. Uh, you got a little something? Actually, she looks good with a mustache. Okay, seriously, did you see Oscar? I want his autograph. Just like mom used to make. Trash-tastic stuff. Catch you next time. Ah, nothing like home sweet home. Oh, I jinxed things, didn't I? It's the spider's home now. Accept it. Hmm. We could go find a hole to hide in, or we could fight back. Uh huh. A spider catcher? Seems pretty self explanatory. Yeah, pretty easy when they stay still like that. Nah. Now that that's taken care of, it's time to get rid of all these cobwebs. Ew. And while we're at it, this wallpaper needs fixing. Uh oh, a hole. <sighs> ramen. Delicious, chewy ramen. Just add some adhesive and add to the wall. 
Add as much as you need. And we can break up pieces so that they fit just right. This is easier than a puzzle. But now it's time for some real elbow grease. We need to sand these noodles down nice and flat. Once that's done, it's time for a fresh coat of paint. Hmm, mysterious wow. floating string. Let's mm -hmm. use it for our next project. Tie on a crayon and use it to draw your perfect arch. Keep making levels until we have enough for a rainbow. But what's a rainbow without color? Time for paint. We're not done yet. Take some colored tape and add pieces to the wall. Use lots of colors so that they all look like rainbow sprinkles. Hmm. Ouch. Oh, let's fix up this corner here. But uh -huh. let's do something different here. Bring out the soldering iron. It'll help you make some grooves into the wall. Well, that was easier than laying down bricks, especially differently colored ones. Uh -huh. wow. Ah, childhood memories. Nostalgia always adds a nice touch. Oh, let's see what we got here. I wonder what she's gonna do with this child's duvet cover. Just add some old stuffed animals and plushies. And it's a brand new bean bag. So, no action figures. Uh huh. For our next wall project, make a design using some tape. When you're done, fill in each shape with acrylic paint. Don't worry about getting a little paint on the tape. It's eventually coming off for a clean finish. See? Now it's time to break out the power tools and climbing rocks. We just need to screw these rocks into place. And you'll be climbing up the walls in no time. Uh -huh. No spider powers necessary. Yes. Hmm. Oh, an old rain gutter. Complete with oh. rain. Let's pour it out. I guess a rain gutter's thematically close to the whole rainbow theme. And we can fill each up with all of our favorite books. So we can see all those nice covers we're not supposed to judge them by. Uh -huh. Ouch! Ow. Now that's a sign you need to clean up. Wow. And we've got the perfect thing. Lego sorters. Hang on the wall and divide the blocks by color. Now let's do something about this light. Blow up a balloon. Tie it up and glue on some paper towels. Now add some leaves on top with even more glue. And when everything's covered and dry, you can pop the balloon. Now put the light bulb in and watch it shine. Look at all the foliage. Wow. What's this hmm. mattress doing here? Guess we're ripping it up. Ugh. So what's inside anyway? Wow. Oh, foam rubber. How pretty. A crescent moon. You know, moonlight is just reflected sunlight. And our moon will need help to shine too. After adding these lights, why not give it a cloudy atmosphere too? All that's left to do is to hang it up on the wall. Hmm. A CD. They say these were of value to the ancients. Oh. First, let's blow off all this dust. Okay. Now we can use it for a craft. Paint it up. And once it dries, we can draw on top of it. 
After giving a bunch some new designs, add to the wall. This broken table's a bit of an eyesore. So cover it with a plastic board and add some tape. Now you can use it to draw whatever you imagine. And when you're finished, erase and start over. Wow! Uh-oh, this marker's missing a cap. Mm -hmm. Oh good, we found it. Talk about the right time and the right mm -hmm. place. This marker's the perfect thing to fix up this table leg. Yep. Now let's have some fun with all this cardboard. Poke in some holes and add a garland with lights. Add a light one by one. Looks like a switchboard operator. Just flip it up. But not that hard. And you can add some ambiance to any doghouse. Watch out! Oh, those poor flowers. Hmm, maybe there's something else we can do with them. Easy. Just add them to a picture frame. Maybe with some leaves. And flatten them up. Oh, what a cute shirt. Too bad you can't wear it. But we can still enjoy it. Add to a frame. Anyone else getting deja vu here? Wow, Wow! this rainbow room is really coming together. Probably should have wiped your shoes on the way in. Wow. There's enough here to make our own beach! But you can have fun cleaning it up. Put on some cleaning slippers. And have your own little dance party. Come on, boogie down! Shake it off. The sand, that is. Probably should put Ew. them in the wash. Just in time. Guests to see all the renovations! You know he's impressed. Time for some rock climbing. Reach for the sky. Uh -huh. And that's just the start. <laughs> Time for some arts and crafts. Who needs paper? <gasps> Don't worry, Mom. It all comes oh. off just like that. Let's just hope he doesn't try this on the wall. Oh, okay. Always time for a quick dance party. <laughs> But back to the tour. Wow. There's still so much to see. <laughs> and with a good book, all that's left to see is the whole world. <laughs> Renovation rific stuff. Mm. Catch you next time. Don't worry, all we need is some old plastic. And a little imagination. Rainbows brighten up anything. Now cut it out and shrink it in the oven. In fact, Let's shrink a whole bunch of your creations. I think they're done. And now, they're the perfect rings. Well, another day, another whatever's in the cup, really. Coins might not be much, but at least they're shiny. Come on, be a pal. Got anything burning a hole in your pockets? Waste not, want not. What's in here anyway? Whoa, we're in the money. What a nice lady. Shopping was fun, but now we should fix up this room. We could pay someone to do it, but why should they have all the fun? First things first, let's get out some paints. And who needs rollers? We can let gravity do the work for us. If you could never settle on a wall color, always go with all of the above. Mm -hmm. Now it's time for a little hands-on approach. Hmm, what else can we use to paint with? 
Well, you already stepped in it. Shouldn't let it go to waste. Wow! Hiya! The room's looking brighter already. Meh. Next up, oh. let's have some fun with these pool noodles. Make one noodle into two. Well, kind of, by splitting it in half. Uh -huh. hmm. Find a place on the wall you'd like to add the flat half. You don't have to use straight lines. Arches can make a nice rainbow. I'm just glad she remembered indigo. Everyone forgets indigo. Wow. Of course, it could use a nice cloud. Maybe a pot of gold, too. Let's add some lights in between each color. Aww. Turn off the lights for the ultimate night light. Ew. Looks <gasps> like Goldilocks was just here. Oh. Luckily, our girls uh -huh. prepared with a 3D pen. Just place the broken piece back where it came off. And patch it up by just drawing out a new brace. Now that it's fixed, our chair could use some decor. All these soft toys will make it nice and cozy. Especially if we cover the whole surface area. Ah, just right. A mouse! Eh, mi casa es tu casa. And this mouse has got a DIY projector. Here's the star of our show, Kissy Missy! We just need to trace out her outline. Place it inside the box, right at the square. Turn on a flashlight to start the show. She makes such a good addition to the wall. Let's make it permanent. We'll just need paint. And what better color for a star than gold? This time, we can do more than just the outline. Color it in. <laughs> and while we're at it, maybe we can fix up this wall. Mm -hmm. hmm. It's time to dip into our emergency ramen stash. Just add glue. Good thing instant noodles come in so many shapes. Add a little more adhesive. Make sure it all sticks. Now sand everything down until it's all flat. The hole's filled, but it could still use a makeover. Ah, too small. Oh, good idea. There's more than enough cardboard. It even unfolds. It fits right inside the corner. I think it needs a splash of color. Uh, make that colors. While we're at it, maybe we can fix up this wall. Remember, they need to fit in the corner, too. Mm -hmm. Now we just need something to keep on the shelves. Ooh, they're even organized by color. I wonder if she bought them in bulk. Well, this rug has sure seen better days. This floor needs a whole new look. Puzzle pieces! A puzzle where all the pieces fit is my kind of puzzle. We can decorate them too. Take out the stencils. And don't forget the spray paint. It's okay if you go a little outside the lines. You still get a perfect circle. With a floor like this, you're always ready for Twister. She's a winner! I, I think. I mean, she's the only one playing. Always good to do a little tidying up. After all, you never know what you might find. Like glitter paper. You can fold it into a cone. It's like a party hat. Complete with a ribbon. Swirl it around. We'll fold these into something different. 
pinch the ends, and their ears. Let's add lashes, too. Hey, what's in here? Maybe we can use it. Now it's hair. Time to give your new friend a hug. A toilet seat? Oh, there's got to be something we can do with that. To start, add a nice wrap around the bottom half. Now that it's all pretty and pink, we can add it to the wall. <laughs> Decorate it with whatever you like. This girl's what? partial to bows. What? Now the seat's other half can hold whatever you need. Mm -hmm. These balloons are so soft. Oh, inspiration strikes! Take out a vacuum bag and fill it up with balloons. Add as much as you can. Looks like you can fit six. Seal it nice and tight at the top. Get out the vacuum. Careful now. Use it to remove all the excess air. Now you've got a makeshift mattress. Ooh, and a pillow, too. But our bed needs a little something special. Get a hoop and tie a few sheets around the rim. Hang it up, and you've just made yourself a canopy bed. Good night. Good thing we saved that poppet toy. It sure is fun. Hey, look at that little stool. They should join up. Just add some cardboard and hot glue, a creator's lifeblood. And plop on a few poppet toys around it. The top, too. If it doesn't fit, don't worry. Just make it fit. It's the perfect thing to help you put your feet up and push some buttons using all your limbs. Ah, button pushing. It's everyone's dream job. This could go in the kitchen, but she has a better idea. Let's start by giving the bowl a new paint job. A few polka dots will make it into a mushroom or maybe a toadstool. We can't forget about the stem. Add white paint. Add some lights inside. Jars are meant for holding. Put the two pieces together. Wow! Make a little garden to light up the night. With a room as nice as this, you'll want to show it off. Careful, this ain't one of those please touch museums. Good thing the paint dried. Oh, treats for the guests. Don't squeeze too hard, or she might explode. Tea parties are always better with company. Good thing she didn't collect bowling balls. Now that the game's all here, it's party time! renovate terrific stuff! Catch you next time! Ooh, here comes the scary part! Whoops! Don't worry, she's got a special vacuum! And he's completely wireless! No strings on him! Good boy! Have another nose bop and relax! You've earned it! Save me the funnies! Oh, look! A dog! Oh, uh, don't you just wish we could have a real dog? Hey, what was that? Let's check it out. Uh, I hope it's what I think it is. It's a puppy! Wishes do come true. Hold on, someone's got some dirty paws. Don't worry, we'll clean you up. 
I'll just take some toothbrush bristles and add to a cup. Don't forget some soap and water, too. Now for the most important part. Some paws to clean. These paws are as good as new. But now let's clean up the rest of you. We can use this net and ketchup? Wait, that's not ketchup, but it can help. Take this shoelace and twist the net around it. Hmm. It's a brand new luva. Add some dog safe shampoo and lather it up. And now it's time to pamper that pup of yours. Besides, it sure beats taking a bath. You know, cats mm, aren't the only yeah. ones who shed. But maybe we can put all this extra hair to use. Like a cozy new pair of earmuffs. <laughs> Not a fan? Try this. Take a beanie. Make some holes. And soon enough... It's a brand new top. Puppy sized. Okay, we need to accessorize. Let's see. Ooh, a chain. Hey, careful. And look, there's a pocket. And we just washed those paws. Actually, that's a pretty nice paw print. Add some decorations and some nail polish. And now we've got our own 3D wow. paw print. Put your dog's name on one side. And it's a brand new dog tag. So this is the thanks we get? Yeah. Well, it's time to get scooping. Huh? In a pinch, a claw clip works great. Yeah, you yeah. should probably toss that. A wash basin? Hmm, this has potential. Flip it over and cut out a little doorway. Add something soft like a poppet toy. Got any extra buttons? Add them to the side. And then add another basin on top. Slice up some pop tubes and add them around the rim. Now look who's got their very own room. Ooh, a window. It's a puppy penthouse suite. Don't forget, dogs also need to stay hydrated. Tape the bottle upside down on a wall. Right above a bowl. Now release the cap. Let the water flow. Now your dog's got their very own drink station. Hmm? Oh, that sock sure seen better days. Let's give it a second chance. Add to a bottle. Add a button. Some googly eyes and a tail. Now that is one fancy rat. And your pup's got a brand new toy. Guess we don't need the paper dog anymore. But with all this stuff, your dog's favorite thing to play with is you. This dog's looking for a new BFF. We've got a match. Let's meet up. Mm. Wow. Looks like her. <laughs> sort of. Anyway. <laughs> we found you your new match. <laughs> so, why don't you come over for a visit? <laughs> what you waiting for? Mm. Come inside. It looks like there's a wow. dress code around here. 
Now let's try some pimple patches. Look, they come with paw prints. Give it time, and the pus peels right off. Uh, you can throw that out now. Wow. Oh, smooth. <laughs> now let's fix those yeah. eyes. We've got just what you need in the freezer. It's an ice lollipop. Just rub under your eyes a few times. Soon you'll look well rested. And it tastes great too. Now let's move on to those teeth. We're gonna need something extra special. Aha! Let's use the new dog toothbrush. Now that's some fresh toothpaste. Open wide. It's time to brush. Now you can taste again. Well, wow. wait 30 minutes. Cool. You know, makeup can really help you express yourself. Okay, that seems about your skin tone. <laughs> Add it on. Uh, let's ask for a second opinion. Why don't we try something else? Now take an egg. Careful, it's fragile. Wow. And cover it up with makeup. Now get blotting. And be careful, you don't want egg on your face. And I'm in the mood for omelets. Speaking of food, you've earned a treat. But it's not for eating, it's for contouring. Just don't forget to blend it in. Ooh, and it smells great too. Why don't you try a makeup pencil next? Remind me not to leave her unsupervised. What you need is a stencil. For now, let's use this coat hanger. Good job! Let's throw confetti! Wait, that's not confetti! Wow, amazing! It's beetroot! Also money, but also beetroot! It's practically free lipstick. And blush, too. Eh, we should probably blend that in. Everything's looking rosy. Speaking of looking, time for mascara. You say it with your eyes. You know, some thumbs would come in handy. At least these paws are good for wiping. This looks like a job for heavy artillery. <laughs> Bring out the glue gun and draw out some shapes. Huh, they could still use some color. Good thing we've got a whole makeup rainbow. Blend the colors to give it a nice hue. Why don't you try them on for size? All you have to do is pick one. Wait, where does it go? Here? No, silly, it goes over the eye. Good thing we made a matching pair. Now let's fix up those shoes and socks. Maybe something less Alice in Wonderland. Oh, a band-aid? Inspiration strikes! Let's put it on your nose and add some makeup. Grab your brush. How about a nice green color? 
Make sure to color outside the lines. Oh. Oh. Now peel it off and add some stickers. You just can't go wrong with teddy bears. Oh, someone deserves to get pet. Hey, what's wrong? Is it her hand? Ooh, you're going to need a mask. That'll perk up your paws. And look. Just unfold, and it's a cat paw. I think that's called a dew claw. Just kidding. Let's tape it down. Gimme paw. Who's up for some patty cake? Okay, that should be enough. Let's see how they look. Oh, it's all so nice and smooth. Except for the rest of the arm. Uh-oh. This calls for special measures. Our special hair remover spray-on cream. Just be careful where you aim that stuff. Oh, that poor doll! But wait, that just means it works! Oh, your arms are oh so smooth! Now for the rest of your hair. Hmm. How about we twist it up? Uh-oh, I think it's stuck. Do I need to get the scissors? Wait, those paws know what to do. Just twist the hair on this drying rack. Some clothes pins will keep things in place. Now, let's get the hair dryer. Should be enough. How does it look? Make sure you took off all the clips. Wow! Hair this good, you just got a flip. Time to take on the world. Ouch! At least we won't need makeup remover. Oh, don't cry. Your furry friend knows what to do. Grab some stretch wrap. Take out your favorite makeup and draw a new face on top. Why don't you try it on for size? Make sure to stick it on. Let's see how it looks. Wow! This pup's got your back. And I think someone's getting a walk. Happy birthday! Oh, and look! This one's got air holes. It's a puppy! Oh, a toy puppy. <laughs> kind of a misleading box. Well, we can still play with it. Let's give it a bath. Sweet Jiminy Crickets! Your love made it a real dog! Thank you, Blue Fairy, wherever you are. Maybe we should wait before we break it to mom. Phew. Oh. Just a few seconds old, and he's already got bugs. Ew. Time to break out the tweezers. Wow, some of these bugs are big enough for a hands-on approach. Ew, someone's got dog breath. Well, don't worry. We've got a brush just for you. Canines are pretty important to canines. Maybe that's how they got the name. Now let's clean up the whole row. Huh, what have you been eating? Now it's time for the other kind of brush. Oh, 
Soon enough, we'll have enough to make a new dog. Quick, let's hide you. Come on. If anyone asks, you're a pile of clothes. Just stay still. Hey. Did you have a nice birthday, honey? What the? Oh, she's just shedding and then dyeing the hair. Hmm. Wow, I can't believe that worked. Ew. Sort of. Either way, it's time for a little spring cleaning. Let's pile it up. Now where's a carpet to sweep it under? Ooh, your pants could use a good swipe too. Uh -huh. Wow, the puppy's really good at hiding. Seriously. Oh, this isn't good. Let's follow that trail of chewed up clothes. Well, dogs like to dig, and dig they shall. Come on, we need to clean those dirty paws. This device should help. It's a shower and a brush all in one. What a good dog. Most would have had five escape attempts by now. Let's dry you off. Well, that's one way. But let's try this bathrobe. And if mom asks, you're a shark. And for being such a good boy, you get a face massage. But don't let the name fool you. It can massage more than just your face. I think there's time to have a turn of your own, too. Wait, I'd be careful about taking a nap. Hey. Nothing to see here, just us toys. Uh huh. Yeah, Mom needs to check those glasses. Now what did we say about naps right now? I'm sure we can sew them back up. But for now, let's trim those nails. Okay, that didn't work. Time for plan B. Ah, plastic wrap. Now it's a plastic cap. Some peanut butter should please our furry friend. Now he won't notice the mani petty. Hey, where are you going? Why couldn't mom fill up on birthday cake like the rest of us? What? You forgot the ketchup. Well, someone doesn't mind. At least you still got your ketchup. Silly doggy thinks he's people. No. Here's something for you. A kibble dispenser. It's dinner time with the press of a button. Bon appetit. And don't forget, moms have to eat too, you know. What? A living room's like a city to this pupper. Ooh, look at wow. all these boxes. Let's have some fun. We can make a whack-a-mole game, but with treats. Besides, moles bite. Quick, hide. It could be moles. Come on. We're in the clear. Yeah. Time to relax with a good book. Let's see. Wow, that koala sure likes eucalyptus. Aw, why don't you come up for story time? Uh -huh. Hmm, good point. How do you get up? Hmm. Great wow. idea. This doggy staircase should help. Come on, it's easy. Just one step at a time. Hold on a sec. I think nature's calling. Though someone needs to keep an eye on him. Make that something. This camera should help. Okay, let's try it out. It's all on your phone. Yeah, I never liked those shoes either. Green with green dots? <laughs> he did you a favor. Still, this sniffing mat should distract him. Especially when you add surprises inside. Pop 
pockets just make everything a little bit better. Let's try it out. And while he's distracted, hide your shoes. Except toe shoes, they deserve to be chewed up. Ooh, it looks like shoes aren't the only thing on his diet. But don't worry, now it can be his new collar. Don't you look dapper and selfie ready. This one would make a great ID tag. The glue gun's the perfect laminator. Just cover it with wax paper and flatten it with a rolling pin. Oh, don't you look dapper, doggy? What other looks would you like to try out? Hmm. Wow. <laughs> well, you heard the answer button. A dragon costume? Look, spikes. Okay then. How about a superhero? We'll just call him Crypto. Uh -huh. Is it a bird? A plane? It's Super Dog. Wow, it's like he really can fly. Well, that was a great workout for both of us. Photo time. The Daily Planet will pay big for this. Ooh, look, an ink pad. Any takers? That's one way to get your John Hancock. Wow, this one's going right on the wall. But here's another way to help him express himself. Add some paint and a clear cover to a canvas. Some dog food on top should help too. Who needs a paintbrush when you've got a nose for art? You know, wall art's a step above refrigerator <gasps> art. Wait, you shouldn't play with paint. Besides, what you need is a chew toy. And look, it's corn themed. Smear some food on the kernels. Now this is what you should sink your teeth into. Ooh, look at the mess. There are paw prints everywhere. Okay, actually, I kind of like it, but that's just me. Oh no, it's worse than I feared. She's got contacts. Now she'll get you and your little dog too. A suitcase? Is she sending you packing? Wait a minute, she's making it a doggy bed. It's the best seat in the house. I mean, look, it's portable. <laughs> Time for dinner. Now how did he get in here? Now that's much better. Let's dig in. Could use some gravy. Hmm. What's that smell? Dogs really need to try out the whole litter box idea. Well, this pooper scooper looks like it makes things easy. Good job. Probably should sanitize the couch. Still, it looks like we got this scooper just in time. Just how many dogs do you have again? all that rain. Oh no, that poor puppy. We have to save him. Hurry. First things first, let's get you an umbrella. Well, that was easy. Now it's time to get out of this rain. Or go to the park? Well, gotta get in those steps. Good thing there's room enough for two. Uh-oh, and this is why you need to puppy-proof. Either way, you need a bath. But better yet, a shower. Just plug it in, and you get a spritz and a scratch all in one. 
This puppy will be clean in no time. Every dog's gonna love the sound of that. Come on, a walk? It's such a great day for napping. Well, we have to go. This cat will show you how to do it. First, let's try this charming cat carrier. Now this is a walk. The kind where you don't actually walk. Always love a nice ride through the country. Rain again? <laughs> Weather's sure weird around here. On the plus side, you don't need a shower tonight. Let's dry you off before things get even wetter. We just need to put you in this snazzy new outfit. Add a blow dryer to the tail and let the drying commence. Now you and your dog can get your hair done together. You should be done by now. Nice and dry. Wow, a retractable lollipop holder. Wonder what the retracting expert thinks. Well, one man's candy is a cat's face scratcher. Uh-oh, look at all those dirty paws. We'll need to start cleaning at the source. This device should help. Just add soap. Just squeeze out the foam and treat those paws. Don't forget to dry when you're done. And clean that couch. Speaking of paws, it's time for a manicure. Time to use your head. Seriously, wrap it up. And cover it up with some wet pet food? Someone isn't gonna mind cleaning it up. Good, a distraction. Now fix those nails. Don't worry, your dog won't feel betrayed. Especially when they learn there's food left over. This kitty's ready for a close-up, Mr. DeMille. If only cats could have fun costumes to wear. Who said they don't? Just look at this little cap. Release your inner beast. Or maybe get ready for the holidays. Say cheese. I mean, you are wearing mouse ears. Litter boxes seem cleaner, but you still need to clean them. We're gonna need a tool for this. Just don't forget a bag. It'll come in handy. Just scoop things up. Probably should ask the vet about that. Maybe the cat's just hiding its veggies in here. See, I told you that bag would come in handy. Good thing, too. This box won't stay clean for long. Oh, that reminds us. It's time to exercise. Let's get ready. Get the leash, tie those laces, and head out. Really working up a sweat. Come on, no pain, no gain. Oh, it's time for a break. It's important to hydrate. And I meant that for the both of you. Hmm. Luckily, we've got portable doggy bowls. Granted, bowls are usually portable, but not like this. Don't forget the kibble. Your furry friend totally earned it. Good, all gone. Now you can wrap it up. By the looks of it, somebody wants a muffin. Oh. And they're not going down without a fight. 
If only we could make a muffin tin treat for Pops. Mm -hmm. Well, just fill each hole with kibble and a toy. Ah, tennis balls. You can never go wrong with tennis balls. Some prefer muffin tops, but this dog can't wait to get to the bottom. Now you're free to dig into those backup muffins. Ugh, where's the light switch? Careful not to trip. Don't worry, your pupper is here to help with a shiny new collar. You can customize the size and add as many as you need. And now your dog's ready for the next rave. Turn off the light, and why not join in on the fun, too? Sorry, Cup, but the cat says you gotta go. Actually, pushing things off tables looks like fun. And these cat paws let you join in on the fun. Let's play with some cat toys while we're at it. The best part, use them to play with your cat. Yeah, that's the spot. Oh no, what cat doesn't come when the treats are shaking? Oh, the toilet, of course! The best seat in the house. Reunited. And it feels mm, suffocating, apparently. Let's use this hanger to help. Cut it up. We'll need to do a little bit of bending. Add a little tape to secure these arches in place. Place on a cardboard base. Just poke through. Cover it up so that it's a little tent. Your cat will never want to leave. And look who's up for a game of catch the finger. Looks like you're about to get a wet one. I'll make that a messy one. What have you been feeding this dog? <laughs> we need to do something about this canine's teeth. Luckily, we've got a special doggy toothbrush. Looks like your cat's not the only one to get hairballs. Well, if you really need to lick your cat, this should help. Your cat gets a good brushing and no saliva. Clean up's a breeze. Why not clean yourself while you're at it? Hard to get up when your moonlighting is a chair. But you can't just ghost your own mother. Here's what to do. Grab a pillow and remove the stuffing. Fill up a pair of old jeans you can afford to lose. Keep the legs crossed together. And now, it's time to make the old switcheroo. While we're at it, why not make a whole fake person? Now call your mother. Sensational stuff! Catch you next time! It all started with the cherry-flavored lipstick. Look, Mom's got a surprise for you. A kitty. What can be better than a flesh and blood friend? A magic Barbie. That's Yay. what. Let's go party. But first, what do we have here? Oh no! Who would toss some perfectly good legs? Don't worry, they're not alive. So, let's use them for arts and crafts. Also a great way to save on stockings. But she's got a better idea. Make three and add some glass on top. It's a table. Oh, look what's over here. Roll it down. 
These walls are in need of a makeover. What can we use? Oh, a candy wrapper. And the best part, it's already plenty sticky. Smooth it out. We're gonna need more candy. Wow, everything looks great. Well, the room. I think you deserve a makeover too. Uh-oh, talk about losing face. I guess this doll's starting from scratch. Okay, start by filling up these shapes. Barbie can do this blindfolded. After all, she's Barbie. Now let's try it out. Much better. Next up, let's cut up some sponges. Make any shape you like. Oh, a heart. Add some paint on top. And start stamping on the wall. Make sure to get all four walls. <laughs> Meanwhile, let's check in on our human friends. Well, her trash is another doll's treasure. It's not much of a hula hoop, but let's add some tights. Wrap them around to bring it together. The four legs should be hanging down. Now tie them to the other end. Add more so it looks like a dream catcher. We just need something to hang it from. Almost done. Now it's the best seat in the house. Hey, what's in your hair? Ooh, a spring spiral. Let's hang a bunch of these too. Hey, watch out. Ooh, look, a wheel. <laughs> la, 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 la. Uh. And a paint roller. It's still wet. <laughs> How about we paint this box? <laughs> What's next? Uh? Old noodles? <laughs> well, maybe we can use the plate. <laughs> Give it a clean new look. And we've got wheels. But the decorating doesn't have to stop there. Still, nothing beats a little name branding. And look who's coming for a visit. It's Ken. And he's a mess. Well, he's in the right place. Let's get you a new face while we're at it. Ooh, clown! <laughs> hmm. Still, let's try the mustache one. <clears throat> Unibrows are due for a comeback. Oh, wait, I'm thinking of unicorns. I guess you just can't beat a classic. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, is your Barbie Jeep for sale? Yeah. <laughs> A Ken dollar should cover this. Don't spend it all in one place. Look, Ken gave you his number. Hi, Ken. What the? Let's try again. I think we're going to need a new phone. Okay. Cut a cat shape out of cardboard. Hot glue some cardboard on the side. Now add a cover on top. Let's add color. Pink, it's kind of her thing. And some purple on the side. Looking good, but our phone still needs a keyboard. It's a Hello Kitty phone. They gotta stick together. 
Hi, Ken. Let's get ready for that ride. Wait, what happened to your shoes? It's worse than I thought. Flat feet! And your shoes don't fit anymore. Well, it's okay. We can always make more. This glass jar should help. Clean it off. Now cover it up with some tape. Add spray foam. Wait for it to dry. Okay, let's trim it down to size. Now we're gonna need a file. Great, now use it on the shoe. Time to add some pink paint. We're ready for a big adventure! <laughs> What's this? Oh, the beach. I know, take some cardboard and use it to make a window. Let's add some shutters on the sides and hang it up on the wall. Slide that beach photo inside. Huh, an ocean view at no additional cost. Next up, take a plastic bowl and start stacking. We'll need a few. Wow, we're making a whole column. Now take some paper and cut it up. Make some frills and put it on the top. We're gonna need a bunch of these. We've got ourselves a palm tree. Ooh, your dress is a mess. Let's cut out those stains. Okay, that didn't help much. It's time to get the rubbish bin. But we're not tossing this dress. The bin's our new accessory. Now grab some colored material and stick it inside the holes. It's like a Thule ruffled skirt. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> oh Whoa. no, what's going on now? It's trash day, dun dun dun. Oh come on, at least sort your plastics. Oh, Barbie will always be there for you. What a happy ending. Now, where's Ken with our car? Is something in there? Oh, this just isn't Dolly's day. Here, this should help fix you up. Wow, she's a living doll. It's time for an adventure. Ooh, water. You drink that, right? Always important to stay hydrated. But next time, this dispenser will help you keep things clean. Fill with something to drink. Let's add some gummies for flavor. Now just put it all back together. Press down and pour something sweet to drink. Raw veggies are healthy. Just eat around the prickles. Don't worry, there's a doctor in the house. Mm, sort of. This poison extractor should help. Great for poison, thorns, bites, and for when you want duck lips. Ah. 
Hey, keep your hands to yourself. This'll help get it out of your system. Pimple Pete here really needs your attention. Wow, blemishes and worms. And all sorts of colors, too. Look, he even comes with snacks. Now let's wash those hands. Just hold on tight. Ouch! Anyone else feeling dizzy? It's okay. This little dino should help. It's our brand new soap dispenser. Well, we're looking at one really clean face. Guess we didn't need that soap dispenser. Hmm, this button might prove to be a problem. Okay, someone needs to stop this. This automatic flush button should help. Just wave your hand and it all flushes. This deserves a round of applause. Dolly's in the mood for a makeover. Ooh, wax strips for unwanted hairs. Wait, don't you want those eyebrows? Will they grow back? I mean, she's a doll. It's okay. We can always draw them back on. Use the stencil as a guide and draw away. Hey, someone's sitting here. Told you to get the twist and turn model. Here, these lazy readers should help. Now you can see what's right under your nose, which is surprisingly easy to miss. Oh, just look at all this candy. It's so hard to pick just one. So why choose? Still, you don't want to get sick. It's okay. Our flamingo friend knows how you feel. For starters, he likes to fill up on candy, too. Can't forget the whipped cream, also. Well, when nature calls... Always good to have some fruit in your diet. Ah, refreshing. Juice doesn't get any fresher than this. Well, if you really love fruit now, wait till you try them all blended together. Just add to our portable blender. Orange soda? Well, I guess it's fruit flavored. Let's try it. Wait, don't you want a cup? Well, that's one way to drink it. For a warm meal, nothing beats noodles. Careful, you've got some hair in there. And not just the chefs, either. Either you need to get a haircut. Or you should try this hair holder. Ooh, makes you look like a flower. Now eat all the noodles you want without worry. Cooking can almost be as fun as eating. Especially if you know what you're doing. But don't worry if you're not a chef. We've got the right gadgets to help. Look, it cracks the egg and holds the shell for you.
Hold on, we need to get some more eggs. Ooh, chocolate. Guess we could give it a go. Great if you want to go straight to the goo. Just don't forget all that chocolate. Mmm, sausage. Don't forget the ketchup. Hold on, we almost forgot the mustard. Ah, you've got a little something on your... It's okay, we've got you covered. Ugh. I think we need to rethink these condiments. This'll help us go from toppings to stuffing. Just add the hot dog to the tube. Now just get that ketchup bottle. Fill up the machine. Careful now. Fill up that hot dog like a jelly donut. Just look at it sliced up. Time for a little gardening. Ooh, corn! Eating corn right off the cob is fun. At least, until it gets stuck in your teeth. Give this corn sheller a try. Twist and turn, and the kernels fall right off. Now enjoy them kernel by kernel. It's getting late, so let's brush those teeth. But you're not meant to use the whole tube. Here, this doll's head should help you. I wonder if these two are related. Huh, great ventriloquist act, but back to those teeth. Should be enough. Let's get brushing. Are you cold? Try a blanket. And some warm socks, too. Oof, talk about cold feet. Okay, this girl needs some joints. It's okay. Socks can slide right on with the help of our sock slider. Just add the sock and slide your foot right in. And it works great for mittens, too. Oh, it looks like Dolly's had a big day. Come on, you just know you can't keep a good doll down. Doll credible stuff. Catch you next time. Hey Mario, are you ready for a new adventure? Let's -a go! A fuller's job is never done. Speaking of plumbing, I guess it's occupied. I think he's gonna be a while. Unless we try out this brand new toilet water bowl. Mm, it's nice and fresh. Anyone thirsty? Quick, before a line starts. Cat cops? Ever seen criminal mice? You're welcome. Must be where they keep the best cat toys. I'm sure he'd be happy to lend a paw. Now fill it up with some hot glue. and scrape away all that sand. Only one way to see if it works. Great success! It was the perfect crime. Hey, it's dark in here! Ow! So hard to see. Is that a dog? Maybe the mystery box can help. 
Look, it's an LED collar. Try it out. And there's more where that came from. Now shine on. Is there any gold around here? Well, that answers that. Yeah, I wouldn't get too close. TP, maybe? Aha! A pooper scooper! Oh, it even comes with bags. Seems simple enough. Scoop it up. And put it where it belongs. You know, I always wondered about those pipes. And that's where gold coins come from. Hey, watch your step, Mario! I'd better think of something before you start seeing claws. Look, it's a dino chomper! Kitty want to lick? Aw, what a nice kitty. Maybe we should change the sign. This dog's bark is worse than his spikes. Stick to head pads. Hey, what's that? Ooh, let's pretend we don't see it. Aha! Oh, hey, that's not a mushroom. It's a pet massager. Try it out. Ooh, a hands-free experience. But that box is none the wiser. Oh no! The bricks are coming down! What the? Is anything real in here? Let's hope this pomelo's a different story. Because we could sure use that shell. Now for a little measuring. And a little cutting. Your pup's got a new helmet. Just in time, the sky is falling! Hey, this mushroom's a mess. Actually, the room's a mess. The perpetrator! Ah, eh, don't worry. Here's something that can help. A cat brush. Seems self-explanatory. Grab that cat. And let's get brushing. And look, it even works on paws. Paws! When it's done, it comes clean off. Why don't we collect all this cat hair? Just get crafting, and soon we'll have a brand new pair of kitty flip-flops. Just the thing for a nice stroll. Or just a day of pampering. Now where is that mystery box? Uh-oh, who looks like we've got company? Let's try this one instead. It's an interactive treats wheel. Open it up and add the treats. Make sure you close it up. Now just attach it to the wall. You think he'll get it out? Great success! And while no dog's looking, this pug's a mess with stress. Cleaning him up is the easy part, but so is calming him down. With our helpful massage tool. 
Now for some tummy scratching. These little hands will get in every nook and cranny. And let's finish up with a face mask. Who needs a dryer? Sunshine's free. Of course, outside does have its drawbacks. It's okay. Take a basin and start welding. We need to cut out a little opening. Now add another basin on top. Decorate. And add something soft around the rim. Some litter is the final touch. And Kitty's got a brand new potty. To contain all those little surprises. What has this cat been eating? Good thing those aren't blocks. You should be nice to mushrooms. Or they won't share their coins. This will help a back scratcher. Um, I meant with the dog. <laughs> the dog! That's a good boy. Okay, lift a little more. Eh, we've got time. Keep on scratching. Hey, careful with those nails. Oh, your poor overalls. It's infuriating. Great, now the basketball's broken. Wait, we can use it for our next craft. Look, it's a piranha plant. It'll probably need a stem. Here, cover it up with rope. And maybe it can use a tongue. Now Kitty has a brand new scratching post. And a throne right on top. Check out this dog mobile. You've got insurance, right? No matter, we can fix it up. When life gives you lemons. Oh, we can just use this cart. Of course, a new ride should look its best. Don't forget to add some headlights. We're gonna need some engines. And an M for Mario. And streamers. Let's take it out for a spin. Oh, it's Mario powered. Guess we'll save a ton on gas. Hello, Mr. Strawberry. Are you ready for your facial? Ooh, it looks like a beard transplant. Well, he always wanted to be one of those cool shaven Kens. <laughs> when it comes to peas, you don't need a whole pod. You can have tons of fun with just one. Hey, that rhymes. But what's really fun to play with is a balloon. Blow it up. You know, we can use it to make a pea pod, too. Let's start out by making three. Now tape them together. For extra fun, let's draw some faces on them. Hey, my faces are still faces. Now give it a good squeeze. All the cats are coming out for this. What a pretty dolly. Let's give her a haircut. I was thinking a pixie cut, but bald is beautiful. Now let's trim some whiskers. Wait, hold on. 
we can whip you up a new weave. Be careful, you might feel a slight pinch. Ooh, who says blondes have more fun? Sometimes you just gotta think pink. Mm, cherry flavored. A plastic cup with nothing inside. What a waste of a good cup. So let's have some fun. Draw something on it. It's a tiny pair of shades. And look, they come in your size. Who says hole punches can only come hole shaped? Especially when you can get the gold star, among other prizes. Let's see how he looks with a few beauty marks. But why not save some for yourself, too? Enjoy your cat nap? Surprise! We've never looked better. And cats already look good, thanks to all that beauty sleep. As every cat knows, it's kind of hard to top a ball of yarn. But we're always up for a challenge. Let's add it inside a balloon. What else? Ooh, glitter. And some clear glue. Ooh, it's nice and squishy. What else can we try? Ooh, ice cream. It's got a nice smile, but let's give it a bigger mouth. Oh, it's nice and hollow. So let's squeeze our squishy ball inside. When it's ready, give it a good squeeze. Just because that one cat wore a hat doesn't mean they all do. All cats have their own sense of style. Some prefer to sparkle and shine. And also wear wigs. And don't you worry, there's plenty of sparkle to go around. Oh no! Cola is a terrible thing to waste. Careful, you don't want any sticky paws. Don't worry, just blow up a balloon. And deflate it into a brand new glove. You could just lap it up, but cats prefer milk. Hmm, you sure that bowl's big enough? Then again, you can't beat drinking straight from the source. We might not have the whole cow, so we'll settle for the others. Bubbles are so fleeting, so let's make a bunch. Here's an idea. Take a bottle and a straw. No, we're not blowing bubbles in chocolate milk. Especially since we're cutting them up. Place pieces of straw inside the bottle top. Use a rubber band to attach it to an electric fan. Now just give it a dip in some bubble solution. Time to turn on your DIY bubble machine. Ah, the artist at work. Let's add some red, yellow, blue. It's SpongeBob. I knew that cat had good taste. Time for Sponge to meet Squeegee. Gotta love that underwater work. Our little archaeologist is hard at work searching for treasure. Just add a little water, not too much. Now time to air dry. Time for some elbow grease. 
I think cats have elbows, right? A running mouse? Let's see if it lives up to its name. Oh, look at it go. No wonder it's so much fun chasing him. I'm starting to understand where the term cat burglar came from. Just what is our furry little friend up to? Ooh, a balloon. I guess he likes it on the frosty side. It's like a pinata. Just scratch it open and collect your prizes. Congratulations! Careful, you might chip a tooth. Oh, now where's that blow dryer? Oh, even better, a hammer. It's time for a little smashing. Make that a lot of smashing. Careful, you don't want to break your stuff. What a good idea. We've still got ice left over. After all, I am feeling a little parched. Time to do a little gardening. Look at that cucumber. Let's clean it up. Keep it lined up. We're gonna start slicing. Or would you prefer to pickle it first? We're only cutting partway through for now. Flip it over so we can cut the bottom half. Why not? Keeps the board scratch free. Careful, we're not cutting all the way through, you know. Because it's much more fun to make a spiral. Hey, squash can come in spaghetti. And why should squash have all the fun? Caterific stuff. Catch you next time. Well, it looks like we've just stumbled upon the mysterious city of boxes. Hey, sup, kitty. How's it purring? Yeah, these cats sure know how to party. Resting up for a big day of sleeping. Jeez, I wonder how they got those posters in there. Oh, look, there's a pair of little dog boots and balloons. Good, they look like a perfect fit. Perfect for a winter workout. Keeps those little paws mess free and looks cute while doing it. Let's try the other one. Cut off the rim of a balloon and add it on. Look, after a walk, the balloon shoes are just as durable. Wow, a donut and a ladle. I wonder what they do. No, wait, that's not a real... Yeah. Well, if you can't eat it, wear it. And it protects your pup from getting lost. Now, how about the other one? A nice big ladle can work just as well. And the best part is, your dog can also help you serve soup. Huh, looks like more things for your pet to wear. But this time, we're going with cats. Make sure Mr. Kitty is nice and secure. Zip up that zipper. Wow. your cat can get lost in a good book as you hold it for them. Hmm. Okay, our plan B is going to be wearing this shirt like a pouch. In you go. Now he's got a nice place to relax as you prepare him snacks.
two different brushes for your cat. Because cats deserve nice things. It even catches and releases all that excess fur. <laughs> now it's a wig. Oh, we're gonna add some special touches to this brush. Cool. It's like you made a little homespun scratching post. Oh, you gotta love that the cat does its own brushing. But all that hair? A licking mat? Oh, and it looks like hanging it up is a breeze. Wow. This should also make bath time a lot easier than usual. Maybe the plastic wrap will work too. Even if it goes on your head? Well, this should keep those aliens from reading your thoughts. Oh, good boy. Doggo stays still during a bath and a manicure. That's a whole spa day. A collar that lights up. Now that is a real fashion statement. This'll really step up your dog's laser tag game. And of course, making him easy to spot in the dark. Then again, we can always make this out of glow sticks. Just keep adding them on. And make sure that they fit, and hopefully last a while. And just like that, your pooch is ready for a rave. Ah, our pets have spent a full day of pampering, so let's keep pampering them. It's like your cat has a bunch of tiny hands with tiny fingers all at his disposal. Toothbrushes will save on batteries, but the important thing is that the cat's happy. Good idea. But a cat can't spend all day being spoiled. It needs some playtime. What cute little mice. And cool, they come in a lot of colors. It makes you wish that real mice were this fun to play with. But as we all know, a cat's favorite toy is the box it came in. Especially when you get to play with it together. Aww. Oh good, now our canine friends get to join in on the fun. And with tasty treats. Come on, puppy, put your nose to work and find those goodies. Seems like fun, but can we repeat this game with a towel? Just lay the kibble on the towel and then roll it up, like sushi. Seems to work just as well, but you're not sticking the toy in the laundry. Of course, after a treat, your dog needs something to wash it down with. Normally, you shouldn't put water in flowers. It's not nice. But this seems a lot nicer. We made ourselves a fountain. Cool. And would you look at that. He likes it. Oh, 
But can a water bottle be more than enough? Let's try it out. Well, as long as it's secured to the wall. Either way, your puppy gets a nice drink. Yeah, petterific stuff. And thanks to our furry friends who helped out with this video. Catch you next time. Oh, look who's here. It's a cute little kitten who lives in a tree. Time for a ride in your basket. Cue the balloons. Ah, flying. It's the only way to travel. The tree kitten has landed. Now let's bundle you up like a little burrito. Let's clean you up. We should start with those ears. This calls for heavy duty stuff. Good thing we've got a fingertip toothbrush. Really get in those whiskers and scrub those messy paws. Almost done. You can dry off and cosplay as a bunny at the same time. Meanwhile, we've got a special surprise for you. Put some holes in this milk carton and add some udders on top. Now it's like he's got his own personal cow. But around here, we go all out for snack time. We've got food, we've got water, we've got buttons. And the piece de resistance, the meat bar. Of course, you might be in the mood for sausages. Who said cats don't like dogs? Especially hot dogs. Now it's time to have some fun with this long tunnel. Add them to some cardboard boxes. Now our tree kitten has his very own tunnel system. After all, why should hamsters have all the fun? Let's add a little personalization while we're at it. There's no doubt what furry friend lives here. Anyone in the mood for tiny billiards? He'll write the great kitty novel on this. What else? Here's an idea. Grab an old t-shirt. Tie up the ends and hang it up. It's a kitty hammock. Throw on some pillows. Now grab a rubber glove. You only need one. Add it around a cup and fill it up with sand. It's great if you want a tiny chair or a moderate-sized hand. Add a reminder of his favorite person, and it's time to explore. I told you he liked her. He plays pool by his own rules. Ah, such a bright sunny day for napping. Hey, be careful on top of that. Even if you can land on your feet. Let's have fun with these paw prints. Add epoxy resin. Decorate any way you want and then add them on a chain. It's a friendship bracelet. Well, a necklace at his size. I've heard of a monkey on your shoulder, but this is better. Run some string through a shower glove's fingertips. 
Our kitty's not the only one with retractable claws. Now we need to blow up a balloon. Well, that works. Make four of these and tie to each of the strings. It's like a baby mobile and a cat toy rolled in one. Cut up some fulmaran and cardboard. It's a tiny sink, complete with a tiny mirror. We can even cut up a straw to make a faucet. Add a dial. And what's a bathroom without a bath? Uh, a gesundheit. Uh -oh. Is that rain tinsel? How'd that get up there? Hmm, this tub could use some tinsel and pom-poms. <laughs> After all, cats don't really do water. What the? I don't think your dolls will miss this garland. Time to see if our kitten likes his new water closet. Probably should powder his nose while we're here. Next <laughs> up, take a sock and put it on a glass. Fill it up with some soil and seeds. And then, some more soil. We'll need to speed things up a bit. Wrap it up and add googly eyes. Why not? Now that you know how to make it, you'll never run out of delicious cat grass. This cat house needs a doorway. Now take the bristles off some toothbrushes and add it to the door. Grooming now just takes a few steps. Time to get out an old plastic bottle. Cut off the end. Now add some hot glue in the middle. Reattach with some string and pull out the neck. Now take a ball and attach with some more hot glue. Just pull it down and it pops open. Now add kibble. And behold, your cat can have treats with the flick of a paw. Why not make one for yourself while you're at it? It's the best of both worlds. Your kitty gets a ball to play with and snacks. Mmm, chips. Eh, never mind, at least we got the two. Tie some jute rope around it. Lasso it up. Add a bunch to the side of one of the boxes. Now your little rock climber can get some exercise. It's also a fun way of going up without stairs. And it's the perfect place for just hanging around. This cute tiny candy ball's the perfect thing for our cute tiny cat. Got something in your throat? Ooh, a fish skeleton. <laughs> Dip it in some paint and decorate the cat's house. That, or just make some fishbone broth. Seaweed in her hair? What, is she a mermaid? Well, it's fish related, so on the box it goes. So tell me, kitty, do you like your new pad? You can just relax and scratch an itch, or go on a little adventure. After all, you're the king of this castle. Who knew that hallways could be so fun? Oh no! He thinks I'm a mouse! Why did I eat all that cheese? He'll be in his equally adorable kitty trailer. Ah, just kidding. This kitty's a real professional. Meow, amazing stuff. Catch you next time. Instant cats. Just add water. <laughs> and they say cats don't like water. Let's just sneak on by. Aww. 
Aww. Nothing to see. Home free. Oh, coochie coo. <laughs> this is going to be a great day. Oh, I jinxed it. Hmm. This bed could use a makeover anyway. Remove this wood. Add a panel to the side. Oh, anyone getting dizzy? A fresh coat of paint fixes up everything. All three walls. Let's see what we can do for the outside. A stencil pattern. Let's spread on some paint. Who says we need a brush? Besides, this is much faster. Peel off. On second thought, a brush can take care of the little details. Look, a cat face. As if you didn't guess who this was for. Hmm, this hole looks scratchy. And not the kind cats like. This cat door will help make an easy entrance. And with the help of these toothbrushes, the cats will get the scratches they like. Let's take a quick tour, shall we? This grass carpet will please the wild cat inside your pet. What else can we add? Hmm, an old pizza box? Cover with tape, and you can make a few steps. Steps right to the cat's own private bathroom. Meet the new and improved litter box. Now, what else do cats like? How about this? Take some rope and twist it around a base. Tie it so it's nice and tight. And your cat has a new scratching post. What else? Maybe they'll like that pigeon. Oh, even better. Take a desk drawer, add pillows, cushions and some toys, and it's a brand new bed. Here's something we can add to the wall. Now your cats have their own private television. Oh, it's getting hot in here. You know, the cats might want a drink. So, let's give them their own fountain. After all, it's easy to get hot when you can't take off your fur coat. Always smart to try things out before trying on the cats. Now that they have water, they might want something to nibble on, too. And we're going all natural with cat grass. And there's plenty of room for a bowl full of cat chow. But let's keep the fridge stocked with wet food, just in case. Everything's really coming together. Let's add some more toys. <laughs> Well, he's off to Wonderland. What's down there anyway? Ooh, candy. Oh, this bowl should fill up the hole. It's the perfect place for some cat toys. And if the cats are feeling a bit hungry at playtime, this toy's the perfect thing. Just add food. See, they'll get a treat when they spin it around. That'll keep them active. <laughs> hey, can we borrow this pillow? Now take some tights and cut them up. We need an X shape with some material in the middle. Tie each of the two opposite ends together. It's like a bed and swing all in one. Let's test it out. <laughs> You know, these buttons can help get their point across. They can tell us when they want water, food, or even playtime. It's a bit too small to be a staircase. But we can still use the base. Attach to the wall, and we've got stairs after all. Hey, you're not using this giant bucket, are you? <gasps> Thanks! 
Huh? Now that we've cleaned it out, we'll cut out an opening. Huh, what else do we need? Huh? How about huh? more toys? <laughs> you can never have enough cat toys. And we can use them for a project. Hot glue them to the patch from earlier. You remember from the hole? <laughs> Add them to the bottom of our can for a soft cushion. Now break out the power tools. We're drilling some holes. After making a few, run some thread through them. It's kind of like a checkerboard pattern. The cats are going to be so happy. Where are they anyway? Huh? I uh, <laughs> think you've got a little something there. Oh, that gives me an idea. Add hot glue, press it down, and it's as good as laminated. Perfect for keychains or personalized collars. <laughs> huh? This cat toy's interactive. Let's add it to our collection. <laughs> Cats sure have good taste. This looks fun. <laughs> cat food? Maybe we should leave some things to the cats. Oh, it's just a toy. Huh? And we've got the perfect place for it. You know, it's a little small. We need to think bigger. Let's get a large glass container filled with water. Fill with stones and marbles. Add a plant. And the finishing touch, these cute little fish. <laughs> I spy with my little eye, well, her eye, eyes, a plastic bottle. Empty it and cut it up. Take the bottom and hot glue some string in the middle. Now use the string to reattach the two pieces. Add a pom-pom to the top and fill with cat chow. Hang it up. More snacks? These are gonna be some lucky cats. Cool, a laser for our cats to catch. Let's try it out. Either it's the laser or she needs to clean her pores. Hard to catch? Just what we need. <sighs> What's on your head? It's like a fidget spinner. Let's add to the wall. <laughs> what can't be improved with the addition of stickers? These pictures will help give it a more homey feel. Some more toys. Cats sure know how to live. Maybe we can put this tablecloth to better use. As the curtains for our brand new cat hangout. Yeah, this is where all the cool cats come to play. Great place for a nap. You gotta for a big day of sleeping. Still, look at all the fun stuff to do. Eat grass. Use stuffed animals as a floor. Or just relax. Looks like someone's ready to play too. Or maybe just stretch. You gotta love all the accommodations. And there's still so much more to explore. Who needs steps when you have a giant scratching post to climb? Unwind, watch a little TV, have a drink. Oh no, he's found the cats. I mean, what cats? Oh, it's love at first sight. meow horrific stuff. Catch you next time. <gasps> Looks like we've got a bonus.
wonder what she's up to. Folding cardboard in her condition? Well, she's sticking it in the corner. Throw down a sheet. Add a layer of pillows on top. And tuck them in nice and tight. Throw the pillows on top of the cardboard for your new bed. It's comfort and structure all in one. Ah. Huh? Ugh, spiders! They don't pay rent and leave their cobwebs Ew. everywhere. Hmm. hmm, maybe all this tool fabric can come in handy though. Yeah. Huh? Let's tie a bunch of these onto a hula hoop. Each one can be a different color, or whatever you like. Hang it up, and it's a lovely canopy bed. Yeah. Who left these pool noodles in here? That's very considerate. <laughs> They're always great for a good craft. Add them to another sheet. Keeping four inside and sticking two out as arches. Add some cushioning and hang whatever you want on top. Ah, a mommy and me pair of sloths. Really keeping on brand. This desk is really proving to be a pain in the... Eh, never mind. Look at all these rubber duckies. Wait, what are you doing? Oh, this should make these corners nice and soft and baby proof. A pom-pom maker? What you gonna do with that? Run some yarn around the device and fold it together like a donut. Cut along the rim. Pull tight and soon you'll have your own pom-pom. Make a bunch and hang along the wall. It adds a splash of color. And it's fun to play with. I think someone let the spiders back in. It's a chair. A chair with holes. The SpongeBob of chairs. It needs a paint job. Use a brush or just use your hands. When it dries, run a ribbon through the holes. So you have two circles. Add pom-poms inside. Some pink dipped bananas will add just the right touch. Now they're horns. With all these spots, this chair looks like a cow. But every cow needs an udder. At least, the girl wants. Just take some gloves and fill with slime. And you can practice milking till the cows come home. Aww. Looks like she's eating cake for two. Lucky. You just can't beat a good bun cake. Wait, what the? Oh no, this casserole dish is all scratched up. Well, this paint will cover it up at least. Ooh, she's adding little gems around the rim. Starting to think this pan's cooking days are over. It's a chalkboard the baby can play with. Or anyone, really. Why should babies have all the fun? Just be happy that wasn't a block you stepped on. In fact, a broken toy can be a source of inspiration. We can paint each of these animals a different color. And line them up all in a row. Hang them up on the wall and they've become our brand new coat rack. Oh, no, 
This cardboard box could make a great tent. Add something soft to lie on. We're indoors. We're not roughing it. In fact, let's add a pretty cover we can secure with clothespins. We can add a few stars, too. Some light can add that shine that stars are known for. Pillows and toys can add that finishing touch. Done with that bottle? We can use that and this towel holder for our next craft. Let's cover up this piece with some paint. Now, fill this bottle with lights and bring them together. Hang some little butterfly clips too. <laughs> and add some cotton to make a soft cloud. That doubles as a charming nightlight. Look at all these shoes, but more importantly, all those boxes. Hang them up for some quick cubby shelves. And it comes complete with covers you can decorate too. Wait, no, it can't hold that much. What are we gonna do with this broken chair? Cover it with a hat? Yeah. Ooh, upside down. The perfect place to keep our secret stash. Guess she's practicing for when the baby comes. Oh my. She needs the practice. Can I have some watermelon? First the watermelon. Now she's turning pool noodles into string cheese. Wait, the way she's matching them up. He's up to something. Oh, she's baby-proofing the floor. At least, part of it. This room's really coming to... And here's our little bundle of joy now. She's ready to go exploring. And while she's doing that, everything else is free to play with. <laughs> Aw, what a happy little family photo. Uh, guess who just flew in on her broomstick? Of course, there are plenty of nice stepmothers. But I don't think she's one of them. Don't worry, Mama's here. And she's got a few tricks up her sleeve. If she's not afraid of spiders, well, she is now. Wow. Now we're just gonna borrow this palette. Maybe a few while we're at it. This looks like a job for your handy dandy power drill. It's okay, just go to your corner. Maybe a snack will calm you down. On second thought, we can use them to make just the right paint colors. I guess white does go with everything. It's time to get painting. And voila! Guess witches aren't all cat people. Aw, poor toy. Don't worry, we'll give it a second chance. Just grab the old stuffing inside. And staple it down into a nice soft cloud wall. Stepmom's not the only one with a pet. This is for you, toys. 
Guess she won't be using this anytime soon. Well, waste not, want not. Let's take it. Can't keep a pool inside, so make it a ball pit. Yay! <laughs> Ooh, what pretty flowers! And so yeah. fragrant! And more importantly, what great tissue paper! We're gonna need to make some cuts! Yeah. Yay. Now we've got brand new fringe curtains! Just make a few to hang up on top! Wow! Let's see what else we can borrow! A pool noodle, always great for crafts. Like making your own personal rainbow. But these mm. walls could use a little something. Ooh, like this old toilet seat. Well, at least she didn't fall in. <laughs> Let's hope she cleaned it first. But now, wrap soft tule around it. Some clips should keep it in place. And don't forget to decorate. Hang up your new fold-out tray. Perfect for a tea set and candy dish. And while she's distracted, Let's take some towels. <laughs> Ew. Oh, she can keep this one. <laughs> After all, it's her dog's favorite. Eh? <laughs> now let's lay down the others. Yay! And start cutting them up into a bunch of strips. Now braid them together. until it's all just one really long braid. Uh, yay! Now roll them up into a circle. Place it on the floor of the fort. And it's the softest seat in town. Eh? Ooh, snack time! What a great idea! Should be enough. Eh, a little more wouldn't hurt either. Nah. Hmm. Now take a long string of thread. Hmm. <laughs> and hang up these gummy bears eh? as your new bead curtains. Or bear curtains. Yay! Wow, balloons! Eh, save your breath. Yay! When we've got a pump right here. And something tells me she's full of hot air. What a big balloon! Let's add some glue. Now cover with some toilet paper. When it dries up, poke the balloon. Now let's make it nice and frilly. A few finishing touches. Pika, pika. And it's a Pikachu pinata. Pika. And what's a pinata without candy? What's that smell? Ooh, fried eggs. You know, you're supposed to crack them. Here, let's show you. Calm down, it's good for hair. Meanwhile, we can use this pan. Paint a big black circle right inside. Decorate with some candies around the rim. Now it's our chalkboard welcome sign. What? Time for a quick mirror check. 
Ugh, you got a little something. It looks like clay. Roll it up into a ball. A few more, and it's a flower. Soon your mirror has its own garden. Uh-oh, now what's she up to? Wow. Oops. Oh no! Oh, she broke that doll in half! Oh, the doll manity! She's half the girl she used to be. Well, why don't we give her a paint job? Piece by piece. And they'll give you a hand, or leg, to hold whatever you need. Hey, watch out for that mop! Huh? Uh -huh. You know, hey. we could actually use a bunch of these. Wow! Tape them up around the handles. Yay! Hmm. And cover it up with Thule. Wow. It's a canopy! <laughs> and it's even got lights! Guess we earned a break. Oh, inspiration what? strikes! Let's lay this board down on its side. Add a tube through some of the push pins. And separate the rest with some blocks. Give it a clear cover and pour in some candy. Don't worry, they come out eventually. Now some soda for the tube. Just make sure to keep your cup ready. Soda's a terrible thing to waste. Yay! Hey. It's time for the big <laughs> unveiling. Look, wow. it's your brand new fort. Hmm? Uh -huh. First things first, who wants candy? And you'll want something to wash it all down. Hmm. What? You can draw whatever you want. Hmm. Wow. But yeah, Yay! don't eat those gummy bears. Anyway, let's look inside. Ah, huh, I think she likes it. Ooh, let's try on these accessories. Looking good. And so is this mirror. And since you're all dressed hey, up, wow. let's have a mini tea party. And don't forget to look on top. Hey, hey, what? Or you'll miss the ball pit. And we didn't forget our piñata. Okay, maybe a little harder. Yeah. Almost there. And we've got candy. Wow, you really hit the jackpot. Nom, 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 nom. And it's so nice and cozy in here. Though it could sure use a waste bin. Either way, what makes it all worth it is all that candy. Oh, what a happy family photo. Though it needs a little updating. What with your new stepdad? Oh, don't cry. You're still daddy's little girl. Looks like it's time to get crafty. Let's get out the measuring tape. And start sawing away. Oh, thanks. Yeah, building sure is thirsty work. Secure the pieces together and stand them up. Let's add a small tower on top. Uh -huh. 
and cover the sides with cardboard. Couldn't be easier. Just hammer into place. Uh-oh, we forgot to leave an opening. Well then, we'll just need to make one. Soon we'll have our new castle drawbridge. Next up, we're gonna need some rope. Thank you. Now attach it to the door. Hook it back to the castle so you can pull it back up. Now we're gonna need a sponge. Oh, I'm sure he won't mind. Dip it in some paint and you can make a brick design. Ooh, someone's hungry. Don't worry, he's part goat. And we've got a cloud stencil. Just add some spray paint and voila! Now, all the best castles have princesses. Ditch the face and anyone can be a princess. On the other side, grab some brushes. Tape them together to save some time. Use a bunch of colors and draw some rainbows on the wall. Hey, why don't you put your face in here? Huh? Don't worry, you never looked better. Told ya, anyone can be a princess. Ooh, a spare tire. We could use this too. Oh, how do you stop this thing? What luck! It comes with spray paint! Let's add a nice base. Now for some nice pink frosting. To make our very own giant donut. Now let's add some toppings. The middle could use something on top. Ooh. So we can add some more candy. Eh, you can never have too much candy. Why don't we spread it around? I think we've earned a little snack break. Wait, inspiration strikes! Let's use these twinkle lights. Store it in a bowl. And with this special cover, we've got our very own light show. Look at all this colored paper. Maybe we could use it. Fold it up and add around a bowl. Now we're gonna need a pillow. Or, more specifically, the stuffing. Add it inside the paper cup. And add some decorations on the side. And sprinkles on top. We've got a cupcake with a cherry on top. Have a seat and a nice snack, too. Now we need some pieces of fabric. Hey, anyone feel a draft in here? Sew some stuffing inside, kinda like a dumpling. Make a bunch of these until we get a rainbow. Try it out. This rug's so soft, you can practically sleep on it. Not so great with a hula hoop? 
Well, we can put it to better use. Thanks, I guess. Whoops, what's that? It's a bunch of streamers. Let's tie it around the hoop. Now hang it up, and you've got rainbow curtains. Careful not to get tangled up. Now we're gonna need a TP roll. Calm down, you can keep the TP. All we need is the roll. Let's dip it in some paint. And add some legs on the side. Add a head on top, and it's a unicorn. Of course, it still needs a tail. Let's make a whole herd flying in the sky. I think it's about lunchtime. Pizza? Uh oh. There's just one slice left. Nothing a little dance-off can't solve. I mean, what can't it solve? Get ready to boogie. Come on, shake that groove thing. Oh, it's neck and neck. Well, that solves the pizza problem. Don't really care for the photo. But that is one really nice frame. Add rainbow ribbons and hang it up. And add some colorful push pins, too. You can use it to hang up all your loose accessories. Hmm, I'm starting to think he's not very nice. Poor little pony. We'll help you. Some glue will fix you up. And maybe you can help us, too. We'll need these. Fill the jar with glitter. Now pour in some liquid. Add the pony with the lid on tight. It's a pony snow globe. Shake it up. Look, it even comes in unicorn. Oh, what a pretty picture. Oh, everyone's a critic. Well, maybe there's some way we can put it back together. Or maybe make something totally new. A few finishing touches, and it's a stained glass window. Wow, it really lets the light in. Now let's get a few more supplies. Ooh, like all of these pool noodles. Let's bend the top into a circle. Hey, can we borrow some thread? We can use it to bind it into place. Now let's add some eyes and a few other features. It's your brand new hobby horse. All the fun of a real horse with none of the mess. Now let's blow up a rainbow pool. We've got the perfect thing to fill it up. A bunch of rainbow balls. It's a shame not to try it out first. Ooh. 
Almost time for the big surprise! Just need to put the plug in! Look! It's your brand new pretty pink castle! Uh-oh! Looks like we've got dragons! Never fear! Your knight in shining armor will save the day! Quick, turn on the AC! Wait, pop those balloons! It's the source of his power! And Dad saves the day! Now let's take a look inside! Remember, it's all for you! Take a moment to take it all in! Ooh, stick your face in there! See, you really are a princess! You even have ponies and crystal balls! And look at that candy buffet! Not to mention that giant cupcake! It's the best seat in the house! Wow, it's like being in the skies! Look! Flying horses! With removable tails! And a rainbow bubble carpet! There's even a bunch of bracelets and hair clips just for you! This window shines a rainbow right on you! And don't forget our tower with a view! You can even see the stars up here! <laughs> now, Princess, your steed awaits! It's time to go riding! And who can say no to a dip in the ball pit? This princess is the queen of her castle! Ooh! Someone's got a new fish! So, let's make a new aquarium! Add some seaweed! And a lot of water! Now, welcome to your new home! Oh, what's going on here? Ah, I see! We're painting with a balloon! And making dandelion shapes! Oh, your doll's gonna love this! Wow! Next up, we're gonna need some tights! Fill it up with stuffing! Also, get stuffing! Tie it up, and your doll's got a brand new bed! <laughs> Let's tuck her in for a good night's sleep! Ooh, a candy toilet! This is a candy toilet, right? Well, if you really need a bathroom, I'm sure we can whip something up! Make it nice and soft! And add some laundry gel. Whoops! Almost forgot the most important part! And its name is toilet paper! Oops! Just need to roll up a few squares. Cut them up for a bunch of rolls. These are going on the rack. Time for a walk. Oh, forgot the stairs! Let's start with an old paper stand! Make some slices and add some steps! Look, it fits right in the holes! Now for some color! And glue!
glitter. Why don't you step right up? Uh, that's enough walking for now. We could clean up all this goop. But it's more fun to scoop it up and make it into dino shapes. Now that we've got them in shape, some glue will help them keep it. Let's add a little something on top. For your new mini table. Fancy tea set sold separately. Mm -hmm. Wow! Oh, ice cream! Make sure to save the container. We can add some earring studs on the side. Add a white cover, and it's a bathtub. One complete with a chain and drain. Now for the faucet. And some water. And if you really want to feel fancy, why not add some rose petals? Come on, keep it coming. A paper clip! And with a few twists, it's a new hanger! And when it comes to hangers, you need something for them to hang off of. Not to mention something to hang. Good thing we've got all these clothes around. Dreams do come true. We've got a horse. Let's customize. Why, when we're through, it'll be a horse of a different color. Or should I say, colors. The whole rainbow. With a few add-ons, it's a rocking unicorn. So let's get rocking and rolling. Careful where you step. Oh, your poor socks. Ew. Well, we can make some new footwear. Add some clay and make some slices. Now for some nice faux fur trimmings. Remember, if the shoe fits, wear it. Ooh, yeah. it's a brand new television. But first, an ice tray full of animals. Add glue to make some cubes. Give it time to dry, and it's... Our brand new TV stand. And a real icebreaker. <laughs> Next up, take an old wire and bend it into shape. You can make a pretty profile. Add some little lights around it. And you can really light up a room. Ooh, careful, that chair's missing a leg. Some old shoes can fill up the space. And why stop there? Cover it in shoes. It's a great excuse to go shoe shopping. Oh, they don't make shelves like they used to. Here's what to do. Get an empty shampoo bottle. Cut off one of the sides. And cover the rest with tissue paper. Uh. 
some sturdy pieces of nail file will be just the shelves we need. Now cover them up with knickknacks. After all, that's what shelves are for. What a cute little washing machine! And look, a sponge! Let's cut it up! Cover it up with some soft material. And add some legs on the bottom. Now let's add something around the rim. Hmm. It's a tiny seat for your tiny friends. It's always good to stay hydrated. And if you save your bottle caps, maybe add some toothpicks or sticks. Dip it in some paint. And you've got a new stool. Let's make a whole bunch. Wow, what pretty crystal earrings. If you have a bunch, lie them down and roll them up. Now pour some glitter on top. And hang up your new chandelier. Is that an old valentine? Let's cover it up with pom-poms. And make it a new footrest. <laughs> wow, this place is really coming together. Well, no time like the present for the grand tour. All new stuff, and it's all homemade. And that was just one floor. Sure, maybe the bathroom could use a few walls. But this shows that with a little imagination and hard work, any place can become your very own dream house. <laughs> oh, good morning. Uh, hmm, down on your ooh. luck, huh? Can't put my finger on it, but I've got a good feeling about today. Did you get anything? Oh, a gold card. Wow! Those numbers should be easy to remember. Time to go on a fun little shopping spree. The toy store won't know what hit it. And just in time, we can give this room a whole new makeover. Wow, paint. Finally, we have an excuse to draw on the walls. Or, well, paint. Yes. Cool. We have every color of the rainbow. Even oh. indigo. And who doesn't love indigo? Well, the straight lines look cool, but I think she's up to something. Maybe she's getting her palm red. Get it? Oh, adding handprints. Seems simple enough. You've definitely got to hand it to this girl. Oh, they're in different colors, too. Ooh. Oh, and look at that. It's all in a pattern. Now, what Ooh. can we do with these cobwebs? Let's hope she bought some spider repellent. Where's that green goblin when you need him? Hmm. Even better, some poppet toys. We can use them to cover the wall. And keep the rainbow pattern going, too. Okay, maybe not the whole wall. But we can make a cool shape in the corner. Perfect for when you want to relax. And just pop some bubbles that Ooh. don't actually pop. Oh, the fun never ends. Oh, that wallpaper. Mm -hmm. Sure, the rips add a nice touch. But that color, <sighs> Ooh, what's she gonna do with that pool noodle? Wow. Uh, 
Okay, rip it up, I guess. Hmm, anyone else starting to notice a theme going on with this room? And no, it's not pasta. It just needs that special something else. And it's inside that pillow. And that cute little cloud covers up that smudge really well, too. Looks like we're not done. Huh? LED strips make for the perfect nightlight. I wonder if we can make something out of that cart. Oh, a paint roller. Uh -huh. Even better, a paint roller with a pattern. And it's bigger too, always a good sign. Of course, every good paint roller, patterned or otherwise, needs good paint. It's even better when you can add more than one color. Really adds to the pattern. Yeah, blue and gold. You know, those were my school colors. Yes. Still, I think it's missing something. Wow, a rainbow oh. ring. Fun to play with. And fun to hang up on the ceiling. Cool. It's like something you'd go through in a fun house. Oh no! Oh. Looks like you broke that chair, Goldilocks. <laughs> Have anything to fix it? Wow. With that pen, you can draw a new chair. Or at least fix the leg. Huh. It's like you're drawing with hot mustard. You wouldn't want to eat that, though. And all your new stuffed buddies can make for some nice cushions. Let's just hope there's enough room for everyone, including you. Don't forget the arms. Let's hope she didn't add too much. Okay, perfect. Puzzle pieces. And they look easy to solve, too. You know what this would go good with? The floor! Or at least maybe a corner for now. Make a pattern. But that doesn't mean we can't customize. Cue the stencils and spray paint. All right, let's see. Right hand, green. Left hand, blue. Right hand, red. Left hand, yellow. Ha, huh, nice. Now you're ready for a game of Twister, even by yourself. Whoa, where did those balloons come from? Ooh, a vacuum bag. It's the perfect thing for all those balloons you got all over the place. Okay, time to count the balloons. One, two, three, four, five. Ah, ah, ah. Now let's just suck out all the excess air. Wait, I only counted five balloons. And you've got a new mattress. Better yet, make enough and you've got yourself a brand new bed. Probably doubles as a massage chair, too. Okay, what's up next? Nice fabric. Mm -hmm. We could make a dress, use it as a bed sheet, pretend to be a ghost, or put it on the floor and tie it to a yellow ring. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Great idea. What's better than a balloon bed? A canopy balloon bed. Look at that Lego! You really don't want to step on one that big. On second thought, you really don't want to step on all of those little ones either. Cool. She made a table! And seats. Are you sure you want to sit on those? Yeah. 
Either way, with a room this nice, it's time for a housewarming party. Oh, good. They put cushions on top. And the best parties have nap times. Don't forget the best part. Plenty of people to play Twister. Not to mention enough people to start dancing with. Nice job. I'm really impressed. Home makeover, terrific stuff. Catch you next time.